name is Pete, and I'm actually joined with uh, my lovely co-hoster. Coaster? Coaster. Coaster. My lovely coaster, uh, Chris. <laughs> but we don't have uh, we don't have our two other uh, crew members with us today, don't we? Yeah, we've upgraded. Uh, fuck those guys. We're on to bigger and better things. Annual upgrade, right? Yeah, exactly. Like on, like on your plan. Annual meaning uh, two, two months? Three two months? Month. We're doing this for three months? Three months. Three months. Yeah. Yeah, we have... Uh, Actually, two sort of artists now, right? Yeah, we're, we're upgrading. I'm telling you, <laughs> <laughs> upgrading. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, we have Nick. Uh, actually, our uh, our editor. Our editor. You've heard us talk about him no. multiple times. I was gonna say now you got a face on yeah. who Nick is. <laughs> yeah. Where's and the then, camera? Uh, yeah. So we got, we got two. That one. Right. You guys got that one. We got this one. No, no, oh, no. Fuck this one. I want to be in that one too. Jesus. You know what I forgot? What you oh. forget? I didn't. Uh, Hit record. Thumbnails, but whatever. That's okay. We can just do the thumbnails yeah. at the end. I got it, whatever. Um, and then we have uh, an aspiring tattoo artist. Yeah. Right. Uh, <laughs> that good. <laughs> Hopefully that's so better than. Oh my! That is terrible. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what is it? What you keep doing your intro? This is disgusting. I was amazing. <laughs> and uh, we also have a very particular taste test. Yes, we do. So um, Peter gave me shit this week because I was like, I have a taste test. And he's like, where'd you get it from? Costco. And I was like, I did get it from Costco. Dude, he always Whoa. gets it from Costco. And uh, yeah, you know what? He called my last one lazy getting it from Costco. But I don't think this is exactly lazy. I think this is a little special. It's not exactly a, it, the right festive, but it's festive. It's there. People are putting up their Christmas shit now. It's definitely yeah, there. I mean... Actually, I can't believe you got a they fucking are, keg, dude. <laughs> dude. There's already radio stations dude. playing Christmas music. Mariah Carey's back, so, baby. Yo, I'm, let's I'm go. <laughs> On that note, I have a meme that I'm going to send you to put like up. I don't know. It's not like... Is it Mariah weird? Carey? Is yeah. it weird the fact that you can literally tell me now instead of be like, Hey, uh, Nick, <laughs> make sure you get this meme in there. <laughs> it's fucking this one. <laughs> Nick, I'm going to need oh. you to put it uh, 42 oh. degrees away. Every year, this Jesus it ticks up. <laughs> oh, man. So, uh, what would you bring? Um, dude, I don't even fucking know. Okay, Brecken, Breckenridge Brewery. Uh, I don't know how you're going to handle this. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how we're going to do this. Okay, um, right on the yeah, how, how are we going to open right this? On the TV. Yeah, right there on we go. The TV, um, so, it's a gallon, uh, 1.3 gallons of beer. Um, Grab it. Don't be afraid. Yeah, it's, it's a Christmas <laughs> ale. It's 7%. <laughs> And it's in a keg. Oh my god, you're gonna fucking break shit. That was really All heavy. Right. Uh, I don't know how to open this, and I have carpeting, so <laughs> I don't know how to open this either. All right, just shotgun it, dude. I'm yeah. still uh, venting the keg. You're not down. It says it says lift this. Okay. Oh, okay. Right. You can do this. Uh, no, I can't. I'm still upset about this beer, bro. What? <laughs> that oh. is disgusting. And it was not good. What'd you have? What is it? Well, first, I'm like, oh, yeah, I don't like sour beers. And he's like, I only got sour beers. And I'm like, all right, I can't, it can't be that bad. And it's some Sour water. beers are fire, though. Kettle soured season. Is that the watermelon one? Yes, it's I, fucking Yeah, fucking. that was garbage. I did have other beers. It looked cool. I, I have other things. Um, pull. Oh, this, I'm so fucked. <laughs> you, you pull and then you twist it. Put the cup underneath Ooh. it before you do it. Okay. Put the cup under. <laughs> I don't want the first glass. All right. Where exactly do uh, does it, it come out though? That's the question. It's that, it should from that handle. Oh, you get it? Oh, okay. You, you I don't can. know which way I need to twist. Oh, okay. I'm stupid. It's this way. <gasps> it's gonna explode. Okay. Was well, it pouring? I twisted and it didn't pour, so I did something wrong. Uh, Dude, you broke it. Okay. I'm telling you, you just have to shotgun it. That's literally oh, a design Jesus for a Christ. shotgun. Okay, so fold the tongue I'll on the top of the keg <laughs> and then turn it a quarter in the direction of the arrow. Do you want to turn a, it a quarter? Do you want to get a quarter for scale? Okay. Do okay. we need? Do, do you need a ruler? I think, I think that's fine. I think that's a whole quarter. Uh, place the keg at the edge of a table. Fold the tongue at the tap forward. Pull out the tap completely. Finest oh, IT oh, pull it completely. guy I know. Okay. Okay. You okay. got it? Is there an off button? Now we... <laughs> Actually... <laughs> wait, 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 wait. wait, what's the off <gasps> button? Well, shit. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It came out. At yeah, least. it's squirted. We just gotta keep Bro, it. this is weird. I'm just seeing hands <laughs> on the table oh, and God. it's directly to Chris. Peter, what are you doing over this there? This is all foam. 
Hey man, bro, this is, this is this not sucks. This is not going the same conversation I'm trying to have right now. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, yeah, you're squirting, Chris. <laughs> Everywhere. Hey man, you got some beer there? Some I got, I got some beer. <laughs> that is all foam. It the... really is all foam. Fucking blow. Hold on, are you tilting the glass at least while you pour it? No, Til- he wasn't, dude. Oh, that's you. Fuck yeah, I it. fucked you... that up. Yeah, dude. Are you, gonna, nice are you actually pouring that out? It's a nice oh, head you got. Well. No, he's going to fill it with water because there's nothing Shit. in it. <laughs> God. All right. Slightly to the left. Beer should start flowing. You know what, Peter? What? I think you fucked it. Why? All right. You uh, enabled foam only. Yeah, you fucked up. Why? Because it's salt. Did you get it? It's getting there. I mean, it's pissing. Oh, I just hear straight foam. Yeah. yeah. It's, a, it's a lot of foam. You gotta pull it out more, don't you? <laughs> nah, dude, it's all the way out. All right, give me your glass. Go, go, go. <laughs> that looks like Guinness, and I fucking hate there, Guinness. There we go. There I we go. I fucking hate. Chris, that's still all foam. <laughs> is it? <laughs> Did you break it? I don't know. All right, this is a. Uh, there we lighting. go. <laughs> Bro, yeah, that's more I'm than a quarter. That's vent. fifty cents at least. Hopefully the vent is better now. Give me, give me, give me a glass. I really hope that wasn't like too much money. Aha! Uh-huh. Also, you have to finish oh, that. Oh yeah, Chris, totally. Oh wait, do you have to like tilt it? You don't. Why no, would no, you no, tilt you it? No, you don't have to. Uh, I don't know. It's that. a full keg. Nothing's coming out. Why the fuck? Chris, you don't. Know. I heard some that time. Oh. Huh? Hey, ah. we did it. We did it right. It's howling though. It's like you know what? It's it's giving me beer. I'm okay. Do you know when I like before I got here, I was like, I really hope it's not a dark beer. I hate dark beer. <laughs> and now I'm looking at, it, I'm like, it's a fucking. <laughs> it's a that dark is beer. dark as shit. <laughs> That's a. Is that a I, stout? Do not. No, it's an ale. Do okay. not give me a lot of that shit. All right, so I'm about to go. How much you want? Just give me a little sample test. All right. God damn! I Yo. knew I should have brought some. <laughs> if you want, I got like Red's Apple Ale downstairs. Oh, I'm about to be a ba- I'm about to be a baby back bitch and drink that shit. That, hey man, that's fine. You're you're filling Farad's spot. That's all he drinks. <laughs> 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 all right, give me your glass. Oh, how much you want? Lay it on me. <laughs> Lay it on me. Okay, just remember. Oh, I Chris heard was it. at Costco. Oh, that, that is the that's pour. A good pour. That is the pour. Chris was at Costco and he's like. Yeah, I'm going to surprise the guys tonight. I'm going to get a keg. That sounds super awesome. Hey, man, it surprised you. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I do love, though? Baby keg. Is wheat ales. I'm all about those oh, yeah. wheat ales. Hey, man. Gut, I was like, Gumballhead is such a good standard on a wheat ale. Good standard, yeah. Um, I think Revolution makes some really good wheat ales, too. It's called, like, Sun Crusher that I really, really like. All right. I think it's official. I just suck at pouring. I hear it. Oh, yeah, it's, it's hissing away. Yeah. Put the mic? Oh, that's a good pour. What do you mean? It's going to be it's going to be about decent. some ASMR of yeah. beer pouring. <laughs> now then, yeah, so for the, uh, for this the could mom. go on Pornhub. <laughs> pour peer, beer pour goes right the first Boy, time. Boy, <laughs> I said not a lot. That sounds like a lot over oh, there. Yo, chill, chill. <laughs> Chris, that's like halfway up the class, dude. No, it ain't. Just fucking oh, up. what? That's <laughs> <good>. <laughs> I really hope it's good, though. Yo, if it's good, right. we got a lot more here. Does it doesn't have a bad smell? Can you, at the same time, I'm not tasting it yet. Can you look this up on Beer Advocate? I'm just wondering what's the rating on this. Uh, dude, that's our Lord and Savior, dude, by the way. Make me fucking do work. I, I remember. Find, I find all my ratings. I remember. Them. I still use it time to time. You do? I do. Do I? L- they actually got bought out. So they're better now. By Untapped. So they're better. Oh. Now. Apparently, everyone hates Untapped. Oh. Dude, Untapped is alright. Uh, I don't even know what the fuck this thing's called, Christmas man. since oh, no, 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 no. Look at the BB. What is oh, yeah, yeah, it? What does the BB. BB say on there? ABB. Bre- <laughs> it's Breckenridge Brewery. There you go. Look that and up. And then look yeah. up the Christmas look keg. Look up that. And then, oh, yes. you know what? You guys are so smart. Or there's a UPC on the back, dude. See, I, I bet if the other guys were here, this would take 20 more minutes. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea. Oh, man. Fair would be like... What, guys can't read like what's your problem <laughs> <laughs> yo you know Farad he's sitting here listening to this shit like you guys are such fucking idiots <laughs> he's gonna call me after he listened he's gonna call me and just be like that's not even what I sound like 
<laughs> that isn't what I sound like. <laughs> Yo, he edited one of those episodes where we gave him shit about uh, being uptight. <laughs> oh, yeah. Did you guys see that? Damn. It was, well, we, it was, we call them high maintenance, apparently. Yeah, we call them high maintenance. And uh, Okay, so I got an 80. That's not terrible. That's was, not bad. That is yeah. actually Interesting. better. Right? Was that I one of the weeks that I was gone and I was I drink 70 Yeah, yeah, years? he edited it. And so and he up asked his fiance, he was like, yeah, yo, like, my uh, uptight. And she was like, no. <laughs> hmm. What do you guys think of this? She's just trying to get laid pipe. Yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> she was trying to get the pipe and that motorcycle. Wait, we tried it? With the- yo, Peter. Oh, my. Yo. What the fuck? Oh, you my. You had me look up some I shit and then you it. sneak a drink? I, I drank it because he drank it. My bad, dude. All right, all right. You oh, asshole. All right, that, guys. That, I just heard him over there. He's like, so how do you guys like it? I'm like, what the <laughs> fuck? Hold it. Okay, okay. I have, uh, I have impressions. Oh, sure. I, get to, yeah. I get to do the cheers. You get to be part of it. Let's see. It does have a bad smell, but let's, I'm worried. Mm-mm. It's I really not I that don't bad. hate it. No. It's it's a watered down stout yeah. with Christmas flavors at the end. <laughs> right? You know what? You really are filling Farad's spot. <laughs> Bro, you taste the best. What, what do you think of this? I like I said, I'm not a, I don't like dirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm enjoying it's it. It's funny because Farad hates everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. If it, someone gave it to me. I'll drink it, but I would not go out of my way buying it. You definitely drink you know it at a party, though, if that's, that's all they had. Oh, no, I'm bringing my own stuff. No, if you Every didn't bring time. anything. You just dragged <laughs> to a random party like after <laughs> some other thing you were having. Okay, okay. Look, if it was this or dying, you'd drink it, right? Mm. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, what? Yeah, what kind of... No, i die. <laughs> really? No. Dude, you really taste the pine afterwards. Like, I'm not lying. Yeah. Like, if you Treat. like weed ale, I got you. I'll give you some good ones. Ooh. It's a, it's a local one too. Oh really? It's uh Chris Lake. Oh, is oh. it Lake, uh, Crystal Lake music Brewing? guy? What? Oh, Crystal Lake. Chris Crystal Lake. Lake. I heard Chris Lake, and I was Chris like, Lake. no. <laughs> Chris no, Lake. Crystal Lake Brewery. You know what? I've heard about them, and I I'm wondering. So the last stuff they make is pretty good. Yeah. They got a beach blonde. You can compare it to uh, it's a uh, spotted cow almost. I love spotted cow. And then their other one I like is uh, like salmon salam fish. Mm-hmm. It's an IPA, dude. It's so it's a red skin IPA. Does that sound right? Yeah, yeah. So I mean, I, so like I, I I'm, I'm happy they don't right. do I, just. I know what those are. Uh, <laughs> okay, it, the the fad all the time is usually just really hoppy IPAs. Yeah, and then stouts. Correct. Yeah. Pastry stouts. You know why? Oh yeah, Peter, I remember that. At least for our area, it's because of a microphone. I feel yeah. like. Yeah. That's a really over. That's a really yeah. hype brewery. The one in Elgin, right? Yeah. Dude, this motherfucker. We what went there. It? Uh, it's called Microphone one, yeah. Brewing. I don't know we we went there once, and this asshole took a sticker from there and slapped it on the fucking bumper of my car. Yeah. <laughs> and then he's like, "It's okay. You're gonna find a nice uh, girl beer, that likes beer." beer. beer. <laughs> and actually, it's funny is um, they release this beer called Smells Like Bean Spirit. Jesus I remember Christ. that. Yeah, yeah. So, so Dude, actually, it's, it's so hype. When I was every when I was working, out. right, there was this um, older uh, lady in my department. I say older, probably like around like 65, 70, uh-huh. right? And she actually lived near that area. And they were releasing stuff, but I couldn't go to it because I was at work. And she you was just getting up. I told her to go and stand in line. Jeez. And she picked me up one of each. Jesus. She said, Can I get two barrel aged bean spirits, please? <laughs> this is for you, ma'am. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's for my son. Is that what yeah. she said? No. So she told you she said. <laughs> no, she doesn't explain it. She's over freaking seventy. No, no, no. show me that ID. No, <laughs> yeah. Looks sketch. But yeah. So uh How's you guys weeks? Oh, yeah. What'd you guys do? Well Nothing. you are you're on a job. What what did you do? Nothing. Time Nothing. passing. Yeah. That's it. So, yeah, well, I mean, what have you guys been doing during, like, COVID and shit? Because we've been, like, you know, locked in. and So, like, how's that been? Uh, well, for me, at least, it was, like, kind of shitty at first. Yeah. Um, So, background besides me just being the editor, uh, I actually work in the film industry. I'm a producer, cinematographer, and basically anything else on the film sets. Uh, I've done from art department. Uh, just recently, I was an assistant director, which is pretty dope. Yeah. Um. But yeah, so besides doing that, I'm also a butcher. Mm. Oh shit! I yeah, know what? That. That's uh, pretty fucking cool. That is freaking metal, Bruh. And it fucking <laughs> let me tell you, it sucked ass. Like that whole panic phase that we had. Yeah. Oh yeah. 
we were working me and the other guys were probably working 14 hour days every single Fuck. day well, people would ask people they're, would just wanted they're asking the food. stupidest shit ever they're like what meat you got then just give me and then <laughs> oh people would try to rip like the place off and i see like old people barely getting anything and then there's this like big fucking dude he's just like grabbing everything i'm like bruh oh yeah. just like stockpiling oh yeah, yeah just like the toilet and paper espe- and shit especially yeah. i'm out in the boonies so yeah. like i deal with all the fucking cr- country ass motherfuckers <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's that's a that's a really that, i i consider that to be a craft it is. Self butchering. oh yeah. yeah you can absolutely you just can definitely meat. like going to a butcher shop and grabbing your own meat is way different and probably a lot better too than but going to like a jewel or something like than grabbing something it does feel weird whenever i walk around i'm like oh, i know what kind of cut that is <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you critique you like oh this fucker didn't like, do it wow. what is that, is that all that marble on that yeah. oh. <laughs> man, I, man i would love to grab some uh some meats from you the so meats you must the be meats. Uh, he wants to grab your meat yeah. <laughs> oh come on i <laughs> knew him. you were gonna make that joke <laughs> <laughs> God, you uh, must see a nice wagyu cut and just be like, whoa. oh. What? Um, Surprisingly, I've never had wagyu beef. So, in terms uh, yeah. of like your I'll training, beef, did you so. did you go through a training process for that, or did you no just, just learn by hand? I literally just watched the guys do it. Yeah, they're around like sixty plus. Mm-hmm. I'm the youngest dude back there right now. Yeah, and literally like just watch them, and they're like, oh, this is what like a ribeye is, and how it comes out, and everything. And I'm like, okay. Yeah. So what's I know what's that. the toughest thing? To butcher like it's the most challenging it's like the or, cut or yeah. annoying or annoying yeah. yeah like what kind of cut of meat i mean it's all the same to me nowadays i couldn't oh, yeah. tell you shapes yeah i mean because <laughs> I mean, like shapes. literally we have bone saws and everything so it's like Ooh. oh this has a bone Let's cut it right through it and we don't have to worry about it okay that's pretty cool yeah you buy a whole pig no oh, that's what <laughs> Ooh, we've had people like try bringing in like cool. deer yeah. Oh no. And like we can't take that just yeah. because we have ours all marked from where it comes from. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So like say that I I do that deer and now it's like yo that thing had like some kind of fucking rabies Disease. or yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. And, and, and now outside, we have to right? figure out where it came from yep. and what is infected on our stuff. Aww. So that's why we don't take anything from no outside unknown. sources. Yeah. Yeah. No, oh, that's smart it's though. Probably just good rule in general. Yeah. Yeah. You don't yeah. trust it. I mean, some butchers, they can do it just because they clean in a different way than yeah. we do, but those are your, like, kill houses, yeah. actually. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean... So I don't do that. I I just, like, ours is, like, we don't have a full-on cow, mm-hmm. but we have, like, the giantest chunks of it, and then okay. we cut it down into smaller parts. That's cool. That's some cool stuff. What's, um... Okay, since you... What's, what's your favorite cut what? of a cow? Uh, I actually like hate steak and everything. Whoa! Yeah. What? Okay. okay fine. Favorite. favorite. <laughs> no. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. So I hate steak, mm-hmm. but like ribeyes, I do really like ribeyes a lot. Yeah. And if you want like your classy kind of good meat, mm-hmm. you'd obviously go with the fillet. The fillet. fillet, fillet yeah. Mm-hmm. I like sirloin. Surprise! I like that fat. The I'm little a, extra fat in it. Just yeah. I'm a T-bone guy. See, I I hate T-bones. Yeah. And, like, New York like strips, I don't... Isn't a T-bone, like, two cuts of meat into one? Or am I wrong about that? So that's yeah. a... No, porterhouse. That's a porterhouse, oh, right? Shit. So the T-bone, if you look for the T actually in the bone, mm-hmm. the right side of it, we cut it out, the porterhouse will have the full thing. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. I think I got a porterhouse then. <laughs> oh, okay. I mean, yeah, they, it was, like, New York Sometimes, on like, like, the butchers will cut it and just leave it in there, but it's still a T-bone. Okay. That way. makes sense. Yeah, cool. I know nothing, so... I'm just like, hey, give me that steak. <laughs> no, I'll hook you up, man. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, that could be something I cook. You, you guys ever so try to grill out? Be like, yo, Nick, we know those We got to get, you, get you in here. <laughs> All right, that's good. Yeah, I mean, um, in regards to that, Chris, um, no, no you. you can't cook. Fuck you. I can cook. <laughs> hey, man. This guy is the most laziest sack I've ever seen I when it comes to cooking. When you guys have these conversations, because there's always the one person that's just sitting there. So what did you make? <laughs> and then you guys are always waiting for them to say chicken. Yo, fuck you. I beat you in the burger cook-off. That's all that matters. <laughs> Suck a dick. <laughs> right, so. I know this story. He doesn't. I don't think. Okay, so me and Chris, <laughs> when we were like in middle school, uh-huh. had a small burger cook-off. I'm not going to repeat the whole thing. 
and um, I made like this amazing guacamole burger. But okay, whatever. Amazing. Right? Took this second is, place because <laughs> because one kid one kid put ketchup on his guacamole. No. Yeah. Was but, it him? No. 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 It was some other kid. No. 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 We didn't judge each other's. Okay. We we had like six or seven other people that were judging, and we were tied. And then he, the the last vote came down to this dude who put ketchup on the avocado burger. Bullshit. Yeah. Dude. And then he was like, well, I hate this one, so I'm going to pick the other one. I'm like, hey, that's a win. <laughs> he, 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 Chris comes in, like, with this little, like, <laughs> container, plastic container, shittiest looking plastic container, right, of seasoning. And he's like, it's my secret ingredient. No. <laughs> Yeah, taste it what was it salt and pepper no it's, <laughs> it's, it's steak seasoning it was, it was fucking crap it's, it's pre-packaged salt and pepper <laughs> it's pre-packaged steak seasoning it's like McCormick's hey man it won <laughs> was it that like taco seasoning that you get like at the end of the aisles old like, El Paso <laughs> Is that what it was? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> you really, you really hit him with those white jokes right now. <laughs> I'm at him half. You Puerto got Rican. no season. <laughs> I can take my spice. <laughs> Salt. <laughs> but uh, so yeah. is that is that a part time profession or full time profession? It's part time, just part-time. because I went to school for the filming. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I literally just graduated. I was super excited to find out COVID fucked me in the ass really yeah. hard from that. Like yeah. we're in, we're in a lot of threat. Like you guys obviously seen like, movie theaters are shutting sure. down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, dude, AMC um, is yeah, that's fucked. Crazy. Yeah, yeah. What well, hopefully, I mean, I've heard rumors of Amazon. They're talking about like buying one of them out. No Ooh. way. Yeah. Uh, dude, Amazon is too fucking big, man. Yeah, they can buy anything. Really. Dude, they bought the most hipster grocery chain in the world. Yeah, it's ridiculous. And then I I can't yeah. remember yeah. I can't remember what movie theater is. You can oh rent God. them out for a hundred bucks right now. Yo, it's you AMC. Can. Yeah, yeah. It's AMC. bro, yeah. you can rent them out for a hundred dollars. It's crazy. Because it's just just one one movie theater. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just one whole and theater. chill with all your friends. I think yeah. you can play like video. Or 30 I've people seen or people something. playing yep. Smash on those fucking things. Oh, I, you know, we gotta funny. do that. All right, so my ex actually worked at AMC, and literally like every month they'd have like a party for all the staff, and they would play Smash and they'd do all yeah, that shit all the time. That's crazy. Dude, we gotta we gotta do that. Put some, Honestly. put some porn on there. <laughs> Jesus. Just Watch hand it. him the disc. Just don't look at it. Just don't look Just at play it. it. Here's right. what we do. Close that fucking Back door. Backdoor slots nine. <laughs> Here's what we do, right? We got we got 12 theaters, right? But pirates. Eight. Half of them are porn. The other half are games. It's a 50-50 chance. Whichever one you go into first, you need to stay in. Ooh. I was gonna say you like you roll a d20. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's too much of a chance. You got to make it 20 different things then. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Then do what? 20 the, different. Okay. Then Fair. the other one would be like what? Um, Let's put like Planet Earth. Another one would be like uh, like Kitchen Nightmares. You just have we have to have some shitty young. shit on there too. Yeah. What's the most garbage thing you can watch on Human TV? Human Centipede. Mary Poppins. Oh, yeah. Mary Poppins. <laughs> what's okay? What's the most garbage reality TV show? Ooh. Kardashian. Kardashian. Yeah. Kardashian. <laughs> Without a choice. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna cost us. Let's see. A hundred bucks, dude. We well, already went over this. It's a hundred bucks for each theater, right? So it's two thousand dollars. Simple math. Is it is it hundred for the entire thing or is it a hundred for a theater? Not the whole theater, dude. Like the one, just one room. Oh shit! One you know what? TV we can convince them if there other people aren't yeah. booked out to like. Just tell Ferret he'll die. <laughs> I mean, probably. <laughs> you just bought a bike. It's fine. Yeah, it's, it's fine. Um, Chris. Oh, you don't want this? No. Right. Oh, pour me more. Oh wow! What a. Badass. I'm not gonna just sit oh, here and shit. drink it. An drink empty coffee. glass. You know what? That is that that is some respect. You know what? That is respect. You uh, you are the first person to have sat in that seat and asked for more of a taste test. Yep. Oh, dude, line them up. Let's out of, go. Out of the one besides other this, besides this, I'm not drinking this. That's I'm sorry. <laughs> it could be that I had gum in my mouth, but I'm just gonna say it tastes like piss. No, I'll say this. Uh, I, do you want more than this? That's fine for okay. now. Yeah, I figure if you want more, we can get more. Um, but yeah, I- I'll say this. Uh, you you said you didn't like sours, and I'm like, hey, this is a kettle sour, and you're like, oh, it has watermelon in it. And- I love watermelon. That's why I'm like, <laughs> it can't be that bad. Yeah. So I just wanted to ask, how is it um, editing our videos? Are we a pain in the ass? More the- so recently. Yeah. O- only if they knew what was happening. You're telling me I could finger gun the camera and sparkles would come out. I'll do. I'll edit it. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Just, peel, 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 just, peel. just remember that wasn't us. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that wasn't us. Okay. No, there's a lot of back stuff that the audience actually doesn't see. Yeah. Especially like Yeah, I could believe it. You guys take fucking ever sometimes. Dude, it's so <laughs> bad. Like 
Like, Jesus. Yeah, we like, do. do you guys like stall or something? Like, no. Nah, like, like, okay. like, what is it? So if you watch the the Halloween episode, actually, that I just yeah. finished, um, there is a good, what, 15 minutes? Dude, they're just sitting there. So bad. They're no. literally just sitting there, and they're, like, fixing their mask and everything. <laughs> These two are no. rambling on about what, I don't even know what the hell they were talking about. At least they're rambling. Yeah, and see, then at one like, point, I listen to the, ramblers. the problem is, is like, so Farad will be the one like setting up the cameras and then uh-huh. he sits down and he gets like this shit ready. And then like, so Dino, Peter and I, we're just sitting here like fucking around Yeah, and just it's recording just, like, for that entire time. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> so there's okay. a lot of times I'm just like skipping ahead. I'm like, yep. oh, come, on, come on, let's get to the, so I'm, I'm waiting for, I'm just waiting for him to look like this. And... <laughs> yeah. So that's why we do that. Like today we just got fucking into it. We, there was almost no downtime. Oh yeah, dude. I just like to talk. I'm telling you, it no. takes yeah, forever. Normally, it's so much worse. <laughs> it takes a while. <laughs> it's a good upgrade, though. Yeah, yeah. Right? It's like, it's not like when you go from an, a regular iPhone model to like the S model, which is like the same. It's thing. a whole y- two years. Two, not even two a years. Year. This is like the flip phone to like iPhone 12. This is the, that's the oh, upgrade. Oh wow, that's a, that's a big, big disrespect. Jump. Yeah. <laughs> I, I figured like from an Damn. eight to a ten at least. But Am yeah. I the only one that's ripping an Android? Oof. Maybe. Me? I think so. Mm, Android gang. Oh, <laughs> yeah. You know, Damn. I mean, I, I just know, I just have an iPad. I draw things. That it's is the thing, though. To my, I'm stuck in Apple forever. It yeah, my life. that's how I feel. In, yeah. in the film industry, everyone's always Apple. And they're like, oh, you're an Android. You got the weird bubbles and everything. Yeah. Like, <laughs> the hell? Don't, I'm not even joking. Dude, I may, you got I may, green text. <laughs> I may have said this on another podcast, but I get the, I get the reverse vibe in when, I used to, when I went to class at my school. Since I'm a computer science major... Right? Yeah. And with my iPhone, they're iPhone. like, oh, yeah. oh, you have an iPhone? I'm like, I'm sorry. Am I not Am I not too fucking nerd for you? Like, That's crazy. Yeah, you're oh. a fake nerd, dude. Yeah, I'm all, and I just tell them, like, it's like blue blue text master race. Blue text master race? <laughs> yeah, dude. Dude, girls girls will s- literally look at that shit. Like, I, if I, you got blue text. I yeah, had I, a girl dead ass. Yeah. She's like, you got those other bubbles. Oh. <laughs> I don't think it's going to work out. And, I, and I, I, I hit her with, like, LOL, you know. Like, yeah. how like, funny. What are we doing tomorrow? Like, she did yeah. ask. was like, yeah. And then, like, a couple days later, I don't think it's going to work. I'm forever. like, no. Oh, dude, it was It's bold. so dumb. Yeah. It, it sucks that that's even a thing. Yeah, it really is. Like, that notion that you have to have uh, blue bubbles. Hey, Apple, Apple's cornered the market, man. Uh, tell me about the, the only company I know <laughs> that where you can pay more for less, considering they don't include a uh, a charging brick with your iPhone oh now. Oh my god, that's ridiculous! <gasps> and no headphones. More yeah. for less. Yep. I know. I know. But oh well. All right, Mish. Mish Ranga. You're gonna be a hot dog. I took a picture. Of <laughs> <laughs> he is such a hot dog, dude. <laughs> hot dog with one foot. <laughs> Yo, send me that picture. We'll put it up. <laughs> yeah, uh, just. Yeah, you're gonna so much extra draw him this one. Just like as a hot dog. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> should have been hot dog for like or something. Um, so actually since, since you are a tattoo artist, right, I'm just wondering, right, what do you our think of this art our tattoo yet. artist? Okay. Yo, Apprentice. dude, I'm, I'm still I'm still waiting. You wax even, on and off you, you totally just skipped the question about how are you and like how the COVID was working. Oh him. man. Yeah, god damn it, Peter. Yeah, right. wow. Don't worry, you're you're editor. I did. It's all right. You're editor. We jump around so <laughs> yeah. much. It's ridiculous. We'll just be like, I got you, man. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> right, how's COVID been for you then, Mesh? It really put a halt to everything. Yeah, I mean, I bet. Yeah, because yeah. I because at the beginning, like, I'm just minding my own business. I'm part of the problem. I'm out in like, there in the St. Patty's parade at the bars, bar hopping and stuff. Yeah. My fault. My bad. Oof. But like. <laughs> After, literally the next day, that's when everything was locked down. Yeah. So that means tattoo shops were closed. Obviously, everything was closed. Like, it was crazy, like non-essential stuff. Yep. So my mentor, he just stopped working for the time being because he was going to leave anyways and open up his own shop. Okay. But then he just took that break as in, like, I'm just going to go home there for a bit or, like, just take a break because he's been fucking drawing and mentoring for, like, 14 years now. So Jeez. this is the first time he's ever had, like, apprentices, like. Okay. I don't think he's ever had. Oh, a you're the, you're gonna be that rogue one though. Like no, no, anime, dude. Honestly, you know? I'm not gonna lie. This is like destiny. Like that I met this guy. <laughs> like, I want to say like five or six years ago, I got the Empire tattoo. Like this, this one right here. Yeah. I the... got this like five or six years ago for my birthday. I was like 19 or something, and he was working at the shop that I first went to like way before back when. And oh, I didn't know it was him. I never asked his name or anything. He was just quiet Asian guy. He just did the tattoo. I gave him money. I left. 
Did he remember you? No. Oh. Two years <laughs> later, he did like my All Might tattoo. Yeah. But I th- this time I actually looked him out. Like I looked at Atmosphere and Schaumburg, and I was like, oh, this guy does like like similar art style of what I want. So he did like this All Might manga tattoo or whatever. Mm-hmm. And then a whole entire year later, like a little bit less than a no, a year and like eight months or so. He's like, I'm looking for apprentices. So I shot him an email and I was like, yo, I would like to be your apprentice or whatever. And I didn't even know that like, he was the guy that did the first one. So it was like just, I don't know. I don't Destiny. Like Destiny. Yeah, no, that's cool. But you know, lately I've just been doing nothing because he's like in the middle of opening a shop and all of COVID like stopped him from opening a shop. And I think it's yeah. going to get open by like January now. So is, I, that, is that the end open. goal? A lot of tattoo artists have to open up their own shop? No, not really. Like it's just he got tired of jumping because he's been doing it forever. So he's got tired of jumping around shop to shop like paying rent where he could just be like, I could just own my own spot and not pay like what is it, like 60% of or 40% of whatever he does to the owner. Like yeah. he's like that's a lot of. That's pretty money, bullshit. and they it's it's a huge growing market right now. It really is. Like I think he said, tattoo shops because people just want it. Like it's becoming way more acceptable. Def- like definitely jobs is. are jobs are like it's okay. Like obviously no hands, no face, still like that's not really that acceptable. But I wouldn't really go that far. Um, well, even then, I, I don't even remember the last time I went into a job interview mm-hmm. with a short sleeve shirt. Yeah, I feel like most people just don't care anymore. Yeah, correct. Mostly. Because nowadays, like our bosses are people our age. Like we're yeah. just getting to that point where it's more acceptable. Obviously, no more if you got like yeah, no, the boomers are the ones who care. Like they, they, they're, <laughs> the ones who care. they're the ones like oh, your yeah. body you got tattoo like, Mickey Mouse. Get the fuck out your of your body. Is a temple. Yo, they Why got that Mickey Mouse that? on their ass though. Right? You know they do. <laughs> <laughs> you know they do. But it's huge growing, so it's like easy to open up. A, well, not really easy, I would say, but like. If you're good, you're gonna make good money. Yeah, they, yeah, these guys could easily make like, especially like fucking Instagram. They pay per hour. Yeah, if, even he's like just only taking home sixty percent of that per hour. If he does like a hundred fifty dollars an hour, sixty percent of that minus supplies and tools, whatever, he's still walking with like it's like 70 ninety bucks, bucks an hour, dude. At least that's good something. money. It is, yeah. That's very good money. And you don't even have to be that booked. Like most artists, they're booked. Like you think Months. that's you. You think yeah, yeah, but you think that's huge. But they're really only doing like two or three tattoos a day, and that they're living like they're running in money. Yeah, I was yeah. gonna say the two like even though I... they're booked like forever, they're they don't do much low key. Like mm-hmm. the two that I have on my chest, I had to book um actually the first one I booked three months ahead. Yeah, the especially second one, realistic the artists. The second one, yeah, it was almost seven months ahead. Like yeah, I so Jesus. so that's another thing. Like different art styles, longer wait period because not everybody does like yeah. realistic. So Some there's people, definitely a, a specialization. Yeah, right? the anime artists are huge too. Like uh, that's what I'm. Oh, trying that's to, a bit. I w- that's what I'm I trying to say. Go to. With me going to They're the film huge. school, yeah. uh, I see so many more anime tattoos. I think it's awesome too. Yeah. I love it. Trying yeah. to finish up. My we actually follow it, dude. We were gonna school. go get a tattoo. Uh, he, from he knows him. about it. Yeah. Yeah, Adam. Uh, Adam Purge. Yeah, I, I showed you him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I was like, yo, go to New York. This guy's <laughs> fucking great. Yeah. But eventually, if you guys can wait long enough, I can do the exact same thing. Yeah, man. Oh, that's some that's some uh, that's in competition there. Yeah. Hopefully, yeah. he's not gonna watch this random ass podcast. <laughs> Probably not. We need to market better, though. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah, true. But we oh do. Well. We do. Shit, I did the thing again. What? Where we talk about what we want done with the podcast during oh, the podcast. Goodness. Oh, you guys did that one episode. Oh, too. we're doing podcast yeah. things now. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> no, they did it terrible one time. It was oh, good, it was, that was a so good bad. good like five maybe yeah, close minute. to uh, ten minutes, and you're like. Well, that was behind the scenes of our podcast. Yeah, I was like, let's <laughs> not do that again. <laughs> but uh, yeah, dude, I'm still waiting for you to do me. That sounds really yeah. Out of yeah. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I already threw you my, my idea, so gotcha. yeah, dude, I need that Lord of the Rings shit. I was see, looking. That, up. See, it's another thing. That's like really not even that hard. It's just yeah. circles. Circles are well. So I kind of, I think I reworked it a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Without the circle. Yeah. That's what I remember asking you. I was like, with the circle, without the circle. You're like, with the circle. I was like, fuck. Yeah. (laughs) In your head, head, you're like, fuck, man. How much harder would it be to do, like, the lettering in a circle on the ring? That's not as hard. See, that's a much easier. What We might do that, though. You can mess up more. What is definitely really difficult, like some techniques? Oh, this is what I was trying to say earlier, but we weren't. Going ham. Let's do this. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Actually, Sorry. I'll get another refill too. I'm, not, no, you're I'm good. just thirsty. Someone's driving their car outside. Wait, what? Anyone really into cars know what car that is? 
That was not a car. That sounded like one of those. I'm like, pretty sure that was a police officer. On, yeah, like, I'm pretty a sure that was one of those like <laughs> yeah, dude. Saudi Arabic alarms telling you to like oh pray at this God. point. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just used to it. I'm sorry. I I was born in Pakistan, so that's what it sounded like to me. I was like, what here? Demonetized. No, <laughs> Wait, were you really though? Yeah, I was born in Pakistan, so I, awesome. I heard that shit like every like few hours. Like, yo, pray, it's yo, pray I, time. When you first were all t- just started talking about, I'm like, I gotta bleep this no. stuff out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's offensive right now. This is getting caught. <laughs> no, I don't know. You just see the lips moving and he's like flinging his arms. <laughs> I can't wait to see the edit. No, no. <laughs> I really can't. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shit my pants. I swear. My bad. My bad. No, no, no. You're good. So, Dude. Anyways, going back Anything to the techniques, I'm not, like, I'm not cutting that, don't worry. Starting yeah. off, like, in tattooing, it's literally like, yeah, I'm just gonna go in there, I'm gonna draw whatever the fuck I want. No, dude, like, he's like, hey, take these letters, trace them, like, three or four times in a day. And, like, yeah. and I just have, like, this long, like, Sharpie type of, like, those ink pen things. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then with that rubberized grip, so because you know how all tattoo guns are, like, thick. He's like, you gotta get used to drawing with, like, something this big. Yeah, yeah, it's not like a pencil, yeah, it's yeah, like exactly. a fucking... And it's like... Maybe like this finger length down. Yep. So it's like fucking far. So I had to get used to doing that. And the easiest way was do lettering, which I also hate doing lettering. No one ever asked me for a lettering. <laughs> which which oh, God. lettering do you hate? Have you done cursive? All those, yeah, 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 the calligraphy oh. stuff. All the calligraphy the, stuff. Like, you don't like I that have, at all? I don't have those or anything, but I might have pictures of those. I was, I was, I was super curious. Like some of those, they do look so clean. They're crazy. But then you also see like the really bad ones. So They're I crazy. Oh. My <laughs> favorite thing is to look at bad tattoos. Oh yeah, it's fun. Yeah, you it's get- great. <laughs> oh, yeah, my it's favorite fun. thing is to look at look at like what I used to think were good tattoos and be like, wow, that's shit. That <laughs> line right there faded in like two years. Done. That yeah. line's gone. And like, can you oh, uh, can you put an anchor on my back because uh, oh, life Jesus. weighs me down? Jesus. Why wouldn't I just put like draw a fake backpack like just <laughs> yeah. a whole, That'd whole be back cool. sleeve of a backpack <laughs> open yeah. pouches make it and like everything a gucci backpack you know, all like. right you did, okay not the gucci part can yeah, you put but, what's a sporty brand jansport wilson <laughs> nike? nike yeah put a nike, yeah, nike. <laughs> although then you get sued nah dude copyright are you serious they'll so. probably no, like, i don't think so all right free advertising you yeah. just they just own you they, Bro, you're not gonna get sued. i just heard that there was you just work for them now there was somebody that just got free internet because they named their kid after oh, a no. Wi-Fi. Yeah, no. yeah, I remember that. I remember Fuck, dude. That. Yeah, dude, it was... Oh, my God. They literally named their kid after... I don't remember what internet company. They're like, all right, you just got us uh, free internet for your life. Yeah, I, I would remember that. highly consider that. You think? Yeah. What? You Absolutely. Think, oh, for life, bro? Okay, for how life? Much money you're saving? Just think about it. No, dude. no, no, until she was 18. <laughs> what if, until she was 18. Yeah, that's they what could, it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah but, but still, 18, 18 years 18. of free internet, that's... Do, do you think just say it's $100. What if it's that they could just gone, change though? the name afterwards? Right? After they get the free yeah, internet. They can and they never change check their name out. at 18. Genius. <laughs> just have it something different in the middle. Just go um, by that. Imagine it's, the bullying, though. Hey, I'm so glad you knew what I was talking about. That's Dude, so that's weird. That's $2,100. <laughs> you just saved $2,100. That's that kid's college money right there. How much are you paying for internet? Like, I just did average 100 bucks. Oh, okay. So imagine kid going to class and teacher taking attendance. Yeah, is uh, Chris here? Okay. Is Comcast here? Is Xfinity here? <laughs> is, um, is, ho- is this Z- Zvinity? Is, is that um, how I say it? Home Wi Fi 5G HSC. <laughs> Jesus. Um, password 1234. That would be a <laughs> but, but, but didn't, his, didn't Elon, Musk name, Elon Musk name his kid like XAI 13 or something? No, he had, to, he had to change it actually. So it was I, a, it was like a it's sound. 14 now. It was a sound or something, yeah. Yeah, it was. It was I saw weird. a meme of like these kids playing some other one other kid and just laughing at them. And. The kids that they're pointing at getting la- and the kids getting laughed at. His name is um, actually just Chris, oh, right? And the other dude. kids that are pointing at him is like Sephiroth, fuck you. Daenerys, <laughs> XAI thirteen. Oh, yeah. dude, I feel bad. Though. No, I feel bad for everyone who named their daughter Daenerys. Yo, especially have, with the way it fun. ended, dude. Oh, absolutely. Like, fuck that. What's the most common name you've got? It like me a, as like a tattoo artist. Oh, I never work with names. Like I said, I'll never do lettering. Oh, you won't do it at all? (laughs) No, I'm just like, hell no. That's just not... You can, like, easily refuse, like, something because other people want other shit. The most common things... Roses, skulls, or any type of flowers. Wait, what about the feathers, yeah. dude? The feathers, feathers are a common feathers one. Feathers and two birds. Yeah. The basic bitch. But, but like, like I see. I would, I would totally <laughs> and do fish, dude. I would fish. totally do flowers. And the infinity sign. You know how yeah. like the the one artist does like flowers, like in his work, like the traditional style yeah. one. I would totally do something like that. 
I had something like that. What uh what's the worst thing that you've had something to do? Something like this? Fire, Ooh. bro. Ooh. That is actually cool. Like I would definitely tattoo this. Like this would be like definitely That would be how many hours? Six, seven hundred dollars at least. That would be six hundred. Seven hundred maybe. maybe. How, how, it's how the long color really for one session work? for one session or two. How long does it take me to draw? Or how, how long would it take you to sessions? tattoo, do you think? And yeah, how many sessions would that take you to do? I don't know, because I've never done a real person. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> how about okay, do you have a guess? He's, he's up, no, like, he's up fake, and coming, don't worry. Fake, fake, <laughs> up fake, and coming. Fake skin and whatnot, like this would take me maybe like perfectly like five hours. Like with the color everything. Oh. That's, color not, and everything. that's actually But that's fake that, skin that's though. Super realistic no, 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 too. But that, yeah. that's just fake skin though. Like with real people you gotta Yeah, they need like breaks, breaks and shit. You need to, like, yeah be easy on their muscle like you can't do it all and like you can most people's skin is resistant can, yeah can yeah. you imagine just some artists i wonder how many times artists are like doing people and they're you know they're complaining like ah it hurts and the artist's like can you stop being a little bitch <laughs> yo right? that's gonna be me no I'm literally sorry. it's like you're the <laughs> no, canvas it's like, not that bad it's not whoever's that bad. like drawing you they don't really care about your skin they care about getting their art out there like yeah. i'm not lying like that's just what it feels like and so Matt, a little my bit my mentor man. taught me he's like yo a lot of there's a lot of tattoo artists out there but don't be one of those shit ones with your shit art walking around like and he's just like some like an older korean dude like he's literally like my mr miyagi like honestly he's thick <laughs> thick accent everything i can can't really understand him half the time yo those are the best he's just people high all the time yeah I'm just high i was, I was gonna double say like, like yeah. your your industry is like it's getting Boom. growing every day oh, man. yeah I, and I'm looking forward to see what's the, what it's. Oh yeah, go. absolutely. Just because, of, like how we were saying earlier, is how acceptable it is now for the tattoos. I yeah. think that's awesome. There's, I've seen there's like TV shows now about it too, right? Oh, Ink yeah. Master. Oh, I love Ink Master. Yeah. Ink Master's great. Dude, and Loki. I used to watch Ink Master like three or four years ago, and I was like, yo, I can easily tattoo. Well, my favorite tattoo thing artists. is like on Ink Masters when they're like, oh, like they don't like the tattoos. It's. Oh. And you're that's like super you're, awkward. You're looking at it too. You're like, yo, that's low key a good tattoo. It's like, yeah. oh, that lines up. I'll never put that on someone's body. Get yeah. that shit out of here. Or when like <laughs> get out. When the customer is like, oh, this wasn't what I had in mind. Yeah. Is it's it's like, like Gordon oh. Ramsay equivalent? Just so you know, master? I bet you yes. though, eighty five percent of those is fake. Oh, hundred percent. Yeah. The, they, the they, reaction. I feel stuff? like they have to know what they're getting without like I've, who the fuck. Precautions? I have been on uh, the commercial though. Behind the scenes. Where it is a hundred percent real. Oh no, dude! This person. Oh, those tattoos that they're drawing. People know they're hundred no, no. percent real. On no, I'm, I'm yeah. saying like okay. I've been on a situation where people like people are like, oh, that's definitely like a fake commercial or situation. Oh, yeah, I've had a situation where we we faked out something, and this person got so pissed, cussed us out completely, drove out of the area that we we're in, and it happened, and almost hit somebody. Like not even like a car, oh, up a, like someone just walking down the street. Oh shit! Almost Jeez. hit him, and we're all like. Oh fuck! <laughs> it was so close. Yeah. What? Damn. Were, were being were they being a little over, like were they over overreacting? Like, yeah. Because they knew you were recording or something. Um. Well, they didn't know what was going on, okay. so it was all raw like oh, footage shit. of them, oh. and we were trying so hard to make them sign this waiver so we can use it. They just didn't give a shit. They just oh. drove. Oh. Like we were walking up to tell them like what's going on, and they're like "fuck you guys" and just drove off. It Sounds was like a pranked thing, but oh, like you couldn't air it. <laughs> Damn. Well, we got other footage of people freaking out, but that worked out. But we wanted that one so bad, we just didn't get it. Didn't get it. Yeah, no. That sucks. Man, I would love to see them like all the lost footage. Oh yeah. Just see how freaking funny it was. Yeah. I mean, fuck with us, we have a lot of lost footage too. So I mean, you know. Yeah. <laughs> you know. <laughs> It's uh, it's like, I think do like a yearly special, like yeah. release all the lost footage. Or yeah. they could, you know, subscribe to our Patreon, Oof. maybe get some of that. Your uh, OnlyFans? I mean, yeah, maybe essentially. subscribe to our OnlyFans and get some of that behind the scenes footage. Yeah. Weren't you guys talking about like making jokingly making it OnlyFans at one time? We were actually. We have a perfect name. And actually, inebriated anal wysis. God. Anal wysis. Anal wysis. I'm so, just telling you. I actually have anal somebody Wysis. who started Wysis. in OnlyFans that I want to get on the podcast and talk to him about it, but I need to try who did to. A, um, uh, I'm not going to say their name. No, 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 not their name, but like, dude? No, 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 check. Girl. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Bro. And I, nice. I, I want to. <laughs> I, I, I want to see if she'll come on and talk about it, but I'm not sure yet. Because you just aren't OnlyFans. I think there's a market for. Bald, bald men, dude. There's oh, definitely that was market. weird on sync. Yeah, dude. Uh, I knew where you were going. Yo, with that. Bitches, That's why. bitches love spinning on them shiny things. Oh yeah, exactly. 
Dude, yeah. the worst part about this That's a is real like, spinner, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are not paying attention. My mouth is just dropped. And, and he's just like... No, they're used, to, they're, they're used to me talking like this, though. We are. This is, this is it's been normal. a while. It's been like, what? We haven't seen you in like Yeah, a year? but it's like normal. Just, <laughs> it's like, hey, hi, what's up? Hey, hi, yeah. what's up? Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. My, my first time meeting him, he's over there. Oh, yeah, sloppy toppy 3000. Let's get that on, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh man, shit, dude! Oh, God, I have a uh, question about tattoos, though. Yes. Your uh, your sensei. Yes. What did he say is the worst to te- like body Ooh. part? I want to know what's. Yeah, worst. I'm actually curious about that. That's, actually, that's a good question. I've heard I've heard the palm is kind of like annoying, and like it fades super easily. Yeah, you gotta be really deep inside, like areas like this or your foot or something. Uh-huh. Yeah. Is it because you use them? Yeah. Right, the skin just replaces yeah. well, itself all the time. That and it's just different type well, of skin. Well, imagine how many times you're using the hand. Imagine you have to yeah, go. Yeah, dude. How many dude, times do you have to go? Exactly. All right. All right. All right. All right. So, if that's the case, right, I will yeah. want a, I want that tattoo I told you about in the car with the little dots on my right hand because uh-huh. I am a lefty. Yeah. And lefty prob- game? it probably cool. wear out in like, like, a, a, like a couple months. No, um, not, not months. No, at least like you got <laughs> any tattoo, you got like baggage for at least like forever really. but, but are you but making, like, even if it fades like it'll still are you making yeah. that claim under the assumption you still that i check that it jack oh. off at a normal Do you rate know how many times this kid masturbates he, he wants you know what he wanted you want, <laughs> Peter, you want, no no you want me to tell him what you wanted sure he wanted like no, no. he wanted like a ruler but like no, 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 listen, no, no, listen, listen, dotted, listen. dotted, dotted ruler, a dotted ruler. But what the fuck is a dotted ruler? No, no, like a dotted circle. Yeah, I'm fucking dying over it. <laughs> listen, l- listen. It was a ruler, but a smaller ruler, so it looks bigger. That's what he wanted. He wanted like a oh. miniature size ruler. Yo, that's fucking actually. That's pretty <laughs> says, funny. Okay, okay. So it's like, like it's incorrect <laughs> measurement. Right, you send dick pics. It's like, oh, my dick is like. No, six no, 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 no. It's no. actually seven millimeters. Guys, that's not what I wanted. Right, no, 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 no. Yes, this is actually a useful tattoo. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, is it? Right. I'm average, I'm but um, hey, <laughs> yeah, you know what they say about people who say they're average, right? Tell me about it. I know. <laughs> so, so it was a dotted line. Yeah. Right. This Going is actually around, what right? he told me. Do- yeah. <laughs> you <laughs> like, this is actually what he told me. Um, it's a dotted line, right? And then, oh shit, Your Peter! Calling oh, God damn it, Peter! Okay, it's a dotted line. I even and, remembered. That's true. And it's it right. has a tablespoon on the outside of it. And then a smaller dotted line inside of that one says teaspoon. So when you're putting like salt and pepper, is that for Coke? Don't don't say salt and pepper. Just I'm say Coke. Weighing out. Okay. Just just say Coke. Do I want a lot or a little? Keep it in the line. Keep it out of the no. line. No, <laughs> no. All right, just just to be clear, it's you just, don't do Coke. It's for rice. You only do heroin. No, I don't do anything. <laughs> what the. <laughs> But I mean, answering that question, though, yeah. probably... <laughs> Wait, which one? The hair one? Or the, the no, no, no. The worst, yeah. Yeah, the, worst, the worst area is to tattoo. Probably lips. Like, they just don't... Ooh. That's Dude, worse than possible. Who the fuck can, gets can you lip tell tattoos? Me why do people do... I knew someone that... It's not as that painful. The, the stupid... They put, um... Because you can hide it. People want to be rebels, you know? They just... What do they you want to be oh, rebel shit. for, like, a couple seconds? Like, yeah. Yeah, no. It'll also... Low-key, it'll probably fade. Like, can be completely gone in, like, less than 10 years or something. Why? Why? But like, why would you fast. get that? Yeah, your mouth. That. How much? You know how, how many times you cost? pick at your mouth? How much shit? does that cost to do the lip? Does that? Does that cost? It really extra? depends. No, 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 no. But it's just an. It's honestly, t- artists don't give a shit where you want it because they're not getting it. Oh, you're yeah, the yeah. ones that have to sit there all like stupid looking for like. Yo, all right. Thirty minutes you know to that an hour. Porn star yeah. that has like the octopus coming out Octopus-y? of her asshole. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no not just... out of her asshole. Dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, which porn star is that? Look, I, I don't it's the red, red octopus, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, yeah. That, okay, Loki, okay. that tattoo's dope. What's yeah. that porn star? Yeah. Imagine, I don't remember her name. We can't put the link it's, in the it's bottom. Like, it's like Tataria no. Love or some shit. <laughs> yeah. All right. I'm just curious. I just want to see that. Just Google it. I just told you the name. It's like Tataria Love or some shit. You don't even need the name. Google but yeah, it, honestly, tattoo. yeah, octopus asshole, you'll find it. <laughs> uh, I've seen weird. Really imagine like being the artist look right now, but I don't. <laughs> I do. <laughs> imagine being the artist. He's a well-known tattoo. artist too. Yeah, yeah. but like that would be so hard. Like that, I, that yeah, has to be you, a sensitive area. How do you tattoo within the side the, the confines if of this the asshole? If the person like completely like is like competent to what you're doing, like if they're like if they'll sit there and just deal with it, they're a good canvas. Yeah, but. Like, so I it's your asshole. Do you have to like, <laughs> like, take you know two fingers you and shave like, everything, bro? Yeah, I know. We have to take two fingers and like probably clamp it open. Or no, because you do like when you're tattooing, you have to stretch the skin. You have to stretch as much as possible to pack that ink in. 
Yeah. So, he's so can you give me a dead. visual representation? He was probably like just spreading them cheeks. Just. <laughs> I mean, so he, for, he had like clamps on him. He had, <laughs> she had to have been holding it. Like, she, there's no way because he's got to yeah. use the gun and like spread more. So yeah. she had to have been just. So for dead. our um, audio only listeners, <laughs> Mish is just showing how to um, how to properly spread an asshole. Spread an asshole to tattoo it. He looks like he has experience. So, uh, since you're still like up and coming and everything for tattoo, how do like I've seen videos of it? Those ink sacks. How do is that from a bad artist or is that like a natural? Oh, like when they're like I've key, seen people. Key, I've or never, whatever? Ha- I've never had that happen yeah. yet. But like, it's just people's what? bodies reacting to it. Like, okay, either, I didn't know if it was either, like a bad artist or something. No, no, no. It's like it. it, it I mean, obviously, the artist is bad if they're using bad shit. Sometimes, like, it could either be from like just bad needles that go into your skin, like the way they cleaned it. Just could could be just distant, like. You need to dis- so disinfect. So what exactly it is that? Because I actually have no idea. Yeah, it's like, exact, it's literally like. Imagine um like a blister almost. Yeah, but it's like oh. but it's filled Blotchy. with ink. Yeah. Oh fuck. Dude, it's weird. And That's I've I've good. seen so many videos and I've never ha- like I've had four tattoos right now. Yeah. And I've never had that situation. I've never yeah, even a lot heard of people of are a lot more cleaner. There's a lot more regulations of who can tattoo and whatnot. If you're getting it in that'll only really happen if you're like getting a basement tattoo or some shit. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, dude, like, I I've fucking, seen some, like, like let's say in- like something like that. Like just Oh god. You see that? Jesus. It's just keloiding. It's just your skin is not reacting well, to it or this something. This is debatable uh, about being shown. Just saying. Yeah. So <laughs> uh, it looks like a pimple. Yeah, it's, it's not that this, bad. This I, I do want to say that. It's, it's, it's not that not bad, that bad. picture at least. So see, even, not even like, gross, not even that. Like I'm or, imagine like a literally like liquids being moved around in a, oh, like a blister. Oh like, God. Are you supposed to pop it or are you supposed to let it go I don't naturally? know. That's why I was I was wondering. Gross, I'll see if I, I can I can say one. I've looked at a lot like, of tattoos. It, yeah. I've never heard of that at all. So. It's really just unsafe. So I, I guess, like, I guess, if you're licensed and whatnot. You're, I, I guess I have one question then is like when you're buying supplies, uh-huh. like ink, needles, right? Wholesale. D- right. Is there, yeah. is there like budgetized versus premium stuff? Oh, of course, right? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. There so what difference does it make? Just shitty quality stuff, really. But like, like dude, just, it's really ink. Ink's like one of the biggest things you'd want to make sure you're getting like good decent, money on. Decent ink, yeah. Um, that and then like the needles. I mean, the needles anyone can make the needles, but you want like verified like disinfected needles and shit like that. Obviously. Okay, yeah. Nowadays, it's not even like the big long needle. A lot of people are like a lot of artists. They're using different like rotary machines. I'm pretty sure Peter, when you got yours, and when I got my older ones or something, they're the Big, loud, like, zzz, you know. It's oh. like four needles at once. So, oh, yeah, shit. that's the ink sack I'm talking about. Like, it literally looks like your skin. Oh, that's that's just the, the, the Band-Aid. That's well, just it, holding the ink. Okay. I swear, it, that's just the clear Band-Aid. Because I, I didn't know. Like, I've seen people. Like, well, I had like, that, too. Like, this thing. It they, was like, they'll just... freak out about yeah, let me it. let see that. I'm just curious. Actually, one they'll thing freak, about Like, that. I've seen people freak out about it, and it's like, you can move the liquid around in it and everything. Yeah, yeah low-key. No, that oh. Band-Aid, that Band-Aid fucking sucks. That's what happened to me. Look, you see this scar right here? Yeah. That's from taking yeah, that Band-Aid off. Right there. Yeah, so it's like a, it's like a, one of those invisible bandages. You keep it on five, six days. When you take it off, your tattoo's pretty much healed at that point. Okay. Yeah, it's, that's, it's that's what I was wondering if it was but a bad artist or happen. something. No, no, no. That'll just happen. Okay. So this thing just filled up with black. Like, it was just a black yeah, ball dude, of it, ink, honestly. Watch videos of it. It's cool, so I, when I but took, it's weird. Yeah, I took it off and I cleaned it and everything, but obviously ripped my skin up, but just got to be careful. So when you're that's not bad. cleaning no, that's, it, that's do you clean bad. it after, like, five or six days, or do you do it, like, once a day So that's shit? new to me. Like, that's, you see, like I said, it's always evolving in one now. Like, yeah. before, when you get a tattoo, I'm pretty sure you do it the same way. You do the same way. They just put, like, a piece of, like, plastic or saran wrap or something. You have to keep it You fresh. take it off after, like, two hours. And then you it just depends go home on the and size. scrub it. it yeah. mine, mine, they were, like, told me three or Yeah, it depends almost. on the size. Yeah, correct. Yeah. Mine were all mainly, like, around, like, an hour and a half, two hours. But you just go home and clean it, and then you just... Try not to you have it touch things. Like, you're just free. Yeah. The worst thing. You put thing. on like Aquaphor or something. But that, you just leave that Band-Aid on for like five, six days. You take it off. You can just start putting lotion on it, really. That's pretty cool. The worst thing, I would think, the one time I got my, my elephant on my chest, uh, I got it right before I was going to Wisconsin Dells, and they're like, oh. don't go in chlorine water. And I was like... <laughs> You tell really? me this now? I was like, bro. Oh, yeah, I'm, yeah. What, what does the, that do? You can't do a lot of things. No scented lotion, no chlorine. It'll... So your skin's already, like, reacting to, like, the ink being pushed in your skin. That's why it gets itchy. That's why it gets, like, swollen yeah. when you first get tattooed. Because it's like, yo, get this shit out Got of you. me. <laughs> but Wow, what a baller. Right? Damn. <laughs> I feel like a pussy. 
So most of like the the, the swelling and stuff, that's just from your body saying, "Yo, this is foreign." I yeah, don't I was want curious it. why they told me not. To. Yeah, I, I, I'm like, yeah. So <laughs> like they tell me, and I'm just I'm like, yeah. So during yep. during okay. the healing process, <laughs> you want it to be like the most like neutral as possible, which. Like Aquaphor, any other like Vaseline type, not mm-hmm. really Vaseline, but like some similar. I was just got like the non scented shit. Yeah, so Aquaphor is the probably the one of the best for it. You just leave that on, and it just heals naturally, and then your body will be like, okay, cool. Even sometimes when I get skin irritations, this will like bump up. You ever get that? Oh, it's just bumpy. This like one. you can like just feel yeah, it. yeah, yeah that right happens here. too. Thank you. And that's just like dude. Of like, course, dude. This is like the most that. beer that seat has ever seen. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> By a mile. Sorry, Fair, you're getting kicked off. Yeah, I'm sorry, Fair. We've been shitting on you a lot today. Yeah, sorry about that, Fair. Because he's gone. <laughs> I fully expect it when I'm off. Uh... Should we Should we do it for Dino then? For Dino, for I mean, Dino? who's Dino? Dino? Yeah, exactly. What's, what's Oh, what, what, Mike? Yeah. Right? Been... Mike. Mike. Yeah. yeah. We taking shots for Dino over here? Jeez. Yo. I, I, I have what do we honey, got? I got Honey Jack downstairs, and I got some really oh, shitty whiskey. I'd rather take the shitty whiskey over Honey Jack. Uh, what about Honey Jack? Yeah, my brother, my brother came over last night, and he was like, "Hey, I got a bunch of beer and shit that I don't want," and he just loves it here. And yeah, like, like okay, eventually whatever. that blood just turns like darker. Okay, yeah. Color. So, so I, I would say that. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, Ooh. Okay. Okay. Like it just turns darker. Whatever you want me to post of your work too during this in- yeah we're, yeah actually, actually, let's, let's, yeah we can take a look at some work too that you put up and i'll yeah. be able to put all that up for him i i'm gonna awesome. give him my uh email to him sweet yeah i mean i i know Mitch is an absolute huge i'm lazy though drag <laughs> we're gonna do it right i'm trying to hype you up over here <laughs> i want to i want to see your dragon ball z art i actually want to uh, i'll show i love, Whoa, love dragon ball z art hold on that one's dope. Yeah. Like this is like one of my designs, too. Yeah. Did you I design like, that one? I designed it. Someone else did it off. Oh, what was that off so. again? Monkey see, monkey do, et cetera, blah, see blah, no blah. Evil, yeah, no evil, hear not, no evil. Yeah, no evil, hear no evil. Yeah, there it is. It's a really cool one. That's dope with Boo. So I got this one. I was like, he was my. I don't get. I don't care what everyone's like all about that. That slim Boo. I like that Boo. Yeah, no, fuck that slim Boo. I like Super Boo, and I like Fat Boo, but I hate Kid Boo. Yeah, Kid Boo is weird. I'm not like super into Dragon Ball Z, but like yeah. I, I followed it for a little bit. You know, it's 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 pop culture. It's definitely anime pop culture. Like, Dude, it's definitely it a comeback though. Like, oh it's yeah, either With most super? people knew it back then. No, not even that. Like most people knew it back then, or most people are getting into it now and they're like, oh, this is trash. But you gotta remember, Dragon Ball Z was the granddaddy of all animes. Like oh, Naruto sure. wouldn't have existed without it's it. True. Like. The original okay. Shonen, dude. Anything, <laughs> like, might, exactly. It was the granddaddy of anime. I'm it's, in the mindset of like I, I know. Years old. Yeah, I've watched Dragon Ball Z too, and like, you, you know, you and me know. I know your hate for it. Yeah, right, but I, I like but it. You gotta respect it. I do, I do. Listen, okay. we remember we used to watch a lot of those Dragon Ball Z movies. Absolutely, those are trash. <laughs> the, I love them. The, 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 the Broly last one I movie. Remember seeing is was Broly at your yeah, house, and, and Goku had four different personalities. Oh yeah, he's like. No, yeah. <laughs> the worst thing. Come on, let's fight. I gotta take this guy down. I need to take a shit. <laughs> Listen, Goku is also a radish farmer. <laughs> we all forget about. Oh no, okay? my tractor. <laughs> the worst thing is uh, the fucking tournament of power arc and super was Love forty-eight it. minutes. No, but that makes sense because they were in a universe that time didn't really exist. Yeah, I know. What? Okay, okay. The what about forty-eight what, minutes? What about what about the Patara thing then? How? You Bullshit. can you can yeah Bullshit. right? <laughs> How you can? No, roll that it? that he did just does. So you can Bullshit. so. Basically, um, do you remember when they fused into Vegito the first mm-hmm. time? They... Yeah, Dernbu. Oh, right. they can yeah. never you yeah. can never unfuse. You can never unfuse, right? That, that was like 10, that was the caveat. Years. They're like, oh, only gods can be fused permanently. Yep. Oh, and it's like, oh, All right, I have not kept up with it. Uh, like our uh, my friend, or your friends, you guys are friends with them too, Jeremy. Like oh, yeah. you told me how there's God, like God saying now or whatever. Yep. It gets better. Honestly. I'm like, what? It's, I'm okay. so tired of seeing really that form. Though. The form is called Super Saiyan God, God. Super Saiyan. Like yeah. what? It's ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> and it's irrelevant now because it is. It which is. I like the newest form much better. It's so cool. You talking Ultra about Vincent? UI? Yeah. 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 I'm a, I'm a basic cool. bitch for Dragon Ball Z. My favorite character is Piccolo all the time. Piccolo's great. <laughs> Piccolo's the real guy. Any of those fighting games, I'm always picking him. But my first he's, man, dude, in any fighting game, dude, he's OP. That special beam can is like an instant, like dude. Or he has like the extended arms yeah. and just have long grab, reach. I just yeah. thought he was like the coolest character, like kind of style almost. Yeah, yeah I just like the way they look. I love the way Cell looks. I love drawing. Oh, Cell. dude, Cell. Like yeah. drawing my Cell looks cool. Drawing Piccolo like and Cell was so, my yeah. my two guys all, all the right. time. I don't even care. Y'all are gonna make fun of me. 
but Jesus Krillin God. has always been mine. Wait, who? Yeah. I Krillin. It. I believe it. Dude, I mean. Bald and short, dude. I believe it. I, I'm sorry. I'm going to have to be basic. I, would I wish have you to... dressed up as him for Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> I, would, I don't have I, to change much. <laughs> I would have to go with young Gohan on here. You're talking about as Super Saiyan 2. Super Saiyan yeah. 2. Speaking, speaking of Saldo, I would say this is one of the best drawings I've probably ever done. What? Yeah, I remember seeing those. Dude, look at that! Look at that color, though. And this was like fifty something layers. Of Jesus. Just... Can I see that? Yeah, go ahead. 50 and I did the background layers. all by myself, just with like older reference photos of other fucking yeah Dragon Ball Z backgrounds. This is like and it looks like almost straight out of like the comics. Yeah, Dude. I love manga style, so I'll use the comic for reference, and then I'll just redraw and then color it. I'll like, see some of the shit you draw, and I'm just like, what the fuck? I, I, yeah, I've I already do. seen it. I, I follow him on Instagram. I see yeah, all this shit. Yeah, he's the only one, Peter. Yeah, fuck you, Peter. Yo, I'll follow you on the gram. Dude, I, I only follow... Bitches love the gram. <laughs> I only have Instagram for beer releases. I'm not even joking. I haven't posted a single thing on Instagram. I believe it. Just like yeah, this podcast? I, I actually, yeah, yeah I absolutely. <laughs> Dude, I don't even think he's subbed to our podcast. Yeah, I am. I am. I am. On Instagram? Yeah. I like like half your posts Yo, on Instagram, bro. I'm your I'm your editor, and I'm not even on there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm sorry, I didn't know we had one until like saw, an hour I ago. I saw you post something about it like once, and I was like, "Wow, they finally did it!" I'm sorry, okay. I messed up. Put a line there. Can you take that out? Siri, come on. God uh, damn it, dude. Oh my. Oh. I'm so sorry. Oh, shit, I touched you really it. Did. Dude, you're, <laughs> you're fucking up his art. <laughs> Wait. I mean, it doesn't look that bad. It, it looked like a signature. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> signature. <laughs> There's a new signature that's not his signature. <laughs> so I'm going to copyright it. Yeah, dude. We posted, like, literally the, the social media for, like, 10 episodes in, in one, one day. day. And I liked at least <laughs> five of them. Yeah. Really. It was so bad. I was like, dude, at least spread them out over a couple of days, man. But this, was, this was Chris's original design that he wanted to get. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's not bad. You wouldn't get that still? No, dude, I want that. So what I'm thinking... Um, it's I'd, the words. I'd, it's not an actual circle. Yeah, I'm thinking are you, about... Uh, are you excited for the words? I hope you're doing the words. No, th- see, fake words I can do. I don't yeah, know yeah, it's just real, the, real the real elvish letters? on the ring. That's all. <laughs> Fuck yeah. real letters, bro. <laughs> Yeah, but that's uh, the I still alphabet. want that. <laughs> yeah, fuck the alphabet. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm still hella down to get that. I've been waiting. Where do you want to get it? Shoulder. Shoulder. Yeah. Yeah. Lord of the Rings. I still want to like. I wanted to get these on me or something, Ooh, or like cool. do it on someone else. I love eyes. Like I have so many. And Naruto's eyeballs, a very tattoos. good anime. Uh, Naruto's very Naruto's the specific. best for eyes. Yeah. Like, I like the, the third one, the target one. The, the this one. Yeah. The, that the is Shari Renegon. That's Shari Renegon. Yeah. What's yeah. that from? Because I don't know. That's from Naruto. Naruto. Yeah, Naruto. Okay. It's I, like, like it's I never. I never got into it. If you look closely, it's like more like shaded inwards and everything too. Yeah, I definitely would need you to do mine and then redo mine that I have. Now. Tattoos? I'll put both. I do. I have one. I'll put I both trying on your ass, that. bro. I know. Jesus Christ, yours is you a lot bigger than you. I thought. Yeah. If you don't want to like draw anything on it, use two fingers. It, it's also from an anime, yeah. dude. You know what I should do for my next set? Should I have like, like the face hugger coming on my my <laughs> stomach or like the xenomorph? I mean, yeah. Hell yeah, <laughs> that would be right huge. on my belly button. Right I would love to see the reaction. Actually, have you, you seen should... the Bart Simpson one? Of what? No. There's one of him like. It's, it's like some famous artist that did it, but he's pulling Bart Simpson's pulling his uh, pants down and like spreading his ass cheek. Oh, and, and the face dude's belly comes. button is the uh, asshole of Bart Simpson. Oh, that's so funny. Yeah, Holy yeah. I'm shit. wondering how artists feel to like do that. You Bro, know, they, like, 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 what, they if, what pay- if you come out? We with just told you. We they, get paid. They don't care. If you don't, don't care. Squirm yeah. or like just bitch or anything okay. <laughs> if you're not a pain that they don't care where you, We're, you put the it film yeah. industry is almost the same way I'll oh say, hands I'll say. hands on the worst that's what I want Let's, I never answered that question hands are the worst dude uh, we all get on shit. tangents all the time don't worry yeah no What what is the worst oh I was just saying the film industry is almost just like that mm-hmm. except we don't do porn you get blacklisted yeah, yeah I heard about I've that I've heard that actually yeah that's actually. fucked that's well kind of like, how does that do work do though porn, because I, at least you're not Okay, you'll win that Woody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe, maybe I was wrong, but like, maybe this isn't a good example. But I'd like, you know, Sasha Gray. Yeah. Yeah. By the way, Sasha Gray, if you want to, you know, comment for us. Oh, shut she, up! I saw her. <laughs> okay. Put it in the bio. Will yeah. you shut up, man? I'm sorry. Man. I'm, listen, it's just a dream how to many, eventually get a porn star on here. How many porn rants have we gone on tonight? So many. Dude. Are you gonna be like Cass so and G? Yeah, it's gonna be actually. It's, it's gonna turn into a porn podcast. Did you see the human I centipede this was a porn? That's your dog. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> Did you get a she was gonna shoot. Like, yeah. So she, <laughs> so she was in There's a. Probably one. I'm not gonna lie. She was in a uh, horror film that it I was, saw. It was a shit. It was it was film. pretty garbage yeah. and stuff. But is there literally a blacklist? Like they'll look you up or something like that? I believe it. 
Yeah. Like your name. Is that how it works? Oh, wait, are you asking? No, I'm actually asking you. I mean, basically, like. They'll look you up, right? Yeah. I mean, you can easily be found. Uh, I mean, I'm even on IMDb right now. Oh, shit. Oh, really? Yeah. That's awesome. That's yeah. really cool. For short films that I've worked on. Yeah. I believe it. Yeah, IMDb's got, like... Literally You everything. do sound setting, like... <laughs> that IMDb really, yeah, is your resume that's more visual. So, it's like, it's like LinkedIn, but for film people. Mm. Yeah. Okay. There, cool. There's awesome. a subscription side that you can you can get, too, as well. Can I have and some it's, more, please? And it's crazy. It's like, there's actors, like, big-time actors. You can get their, their um... What should I call it? I can't think of the word. Their um, agent's number, and you can contact them. Yeah, from IMDb, oh, okay. right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. If you just send a request or something. Yeah, it's uh, like a, I forgot how much it costs for the IMDb bro, but yeah, you can do that. Bro? IMDb pro. bro? Oh. Pro. <laughs> Yo, they should stop calling things Yo, pro. I just want to say. Do you not know how to pour? I, I nope. just want to say. I fucked Tilt the cup. Mine, I did. I thought I did. Mine has been all right, right? Yeah. My, my pours have been okay. I this don't want is drinking good. no more. Uh. <laughs> See, when, I first, when you first poured it, I'm like, this is a Guinness. Yeah, so that's I, why I got worried. I hate getting. Right? I figured out what happened. Uh, so I'm stupid, and I closed the valve up top instead of opening it, and that's why I was all foam. Who said I thought he open it? <laughs> <laughs> so what? What are you, some of your favorite like commercials that you guys have ever seen? Then speaking of like anything film or anything, well, I mean, like Airheads it has commercials, Super Bowl commercials, are Airheads good. commercials. I've had teach my, like well, uh, some of my professors and stuff. They've done uh, Super Bowl commercials. There's one I don't remember. It, it might be on YouTube. Forgot what town it was, but it was for um, the hot dog car, Wiener Mobile. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. They drove Watch all the way up to Alaska to this house. You guys might have talked about it before. There's a house, or not even a house, an apartment complex in Alaska that the entire city lives in. Oh, what the fuck? Whoa. Yeah. It just it's just one skyscraper. And everything's in that one skyscraper. From, That's awesome. From grocery stores Whoa. to like your local care Dude, center. Dude, that bitch goes down though. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> and, and you have to go through a tunnel, and I, I, I want to say it's like two miles long. Jeez. Okay. It's the weirdest thing, and they drove it all the way through there. That's super the, efficient, though. Huh? That, that's really efficient. Yeah, it's just super weird, and Alaska's random as hell sometimes. I went yeah. to Alaska. Actually, a beautiful place. Believe it or not. Yeah. Didn't you talk about that? Yeah, you totally. talked about it in the Halloween one. It's really weird. No nighttime. Yeah. Yeah, I was... Wait, at all, You though? were just like, super depressed all the time, right? Like, like it's, it's like 1 o'clock in the morning, and no, I go one, outside. 1 p.m., you mean? No, no, no. No, it 1 was, o'clock in the morning. It was all daylight at the time he Oh, went. you just said no no light. No, he said, he said no nighttime. Oh, all light. Yeah. Or no the, nighttime. Uh, the, no nighttime. Okay, it, it depends on what time you go there. I I'm thought you sure, said only nighttime. Right? I, I'm pretty sure there are sometimes you'll go yeah, there. Yeah, there's only there's, nighttime. Yeah, there's like... 30 days a night. Yeah, yeah. It's usually like a month of just darkness. That's a movie. It's fucking... No, it's <laughs> true too, though. But it's, it's true too, though. Mitch, that's a movie. It's a true story. The vampires are real. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> the Lost Boys, they're up there. Hey, man. We're not trying to get uh, attacked Dracula. by vampires here. Vampires are not real. That, okay, I thought it was more like that. That's oh wait, isn't that a movie? Witter, wow, Witter, Alaska or Whiter? Didn't they make Alaska. a movie about this so, place? So the city, the, or you're telling me the city, the city boundaries, right, are within that. Th- that there that is, is the there city. is other buildings. Your majority populations in this. That's that's, that's cool. kind of cool though. Honestly, it feels like a utopia. Yeah, dude, you would you would yeah, know you would know, it, you would know yeah, your neighbors so and all that yeah. stuff. I I don't Absolutely. think I'd want to live there though. I'll be honest. I would. Oh, Dude, you marry not. you you marry like the girl from two doors down. <laughs> Divorce her. He, like, he hurt some people outside. Yeah, all, all, see you now. Yeah, all the people you know, <laughs> all people know that you're down. an asshole now. Interesting. He's some, too stupid to knock the camera down. Some of my um, old favorite commercials that I absolutely loved. I don't know why, or even today, I think are a lot of the ins- like insurance commercials. Mayhem. Like the old oh, Geico yeah. commercials. You don't like Geico, the Mayhem, the mayhem no. guy. He's kind of funny. Yeah, the, guy, I, I like the Geico mayhem. ones are my favorite. Like when there's one just going up and esc- there's a guy, there's oh, a caveman. The, the cave, dude. Yeah, the dude. Classic. Oh, those are great. Dude, the when, classic. Uh, when he's going up the escalator so and he's like in a suit, right? It. And he saw, yeah, he saw the billboard saying it's so he's a caveman doing. He's just so offended. And, and he's and like, he's just like, oh, what is this, dude? Those are those are so even even the old progressive commercials with flow. 
Because she's yeah. so awkward. Yeah, yeah those so are good. Early, I like early flow. Er, yeah. Early flow, yeah. Not late the flow. New late flow season. She's this, very confident she's a, now. She's professional yeah. now. Oh, yeah. 100%. Have you guys seen the new early ones where they're like bringing in new people? I'm no, like, no, no. I like I that like new this. guy. No, no. That new guy she's the, been like, training funny. Like the for the last like, guy few, few, few years. Super awkward, yeah. yeah he's great. She's like, no, no, like this. I love that. You see the chick that doesn't give a fuck about like anything? No. I don't like her. I like the I like the other guy who's learning from flow. Yeah. He was great. He's all right. He's all right. He was great. I hate the Clydesdales. Speaking of like insurance commercials though, but like even their uh fucking I listen to at work we only listen to like Pandora and fucking Spotify <laughs> cuz yeah. yeah. So sometimes like I think like back a while ago and all stay one will come on. You know how his deep and raspy his voice is. Yeah. Ooh. Like this is uh, a genius commercial. It's like it's Morgan like, Freeman but like not him. Yeah, Morgan, Morgan Freeman. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is the Allstate guy. You know this guy. Yeah, yeah. It's not Morgan. No, it's, it's not no, Morgan no, Freeman. This but, super yeah. deep. Morgan Freeman's not really that deep. This guy's just Allstate. Hey, but fucking no, I, no. I, like I here's the commercial. Here's like. the commercial. <laughs> it starts off as like a normal guy is like with Allstate. <clears throat> With all straight, <laughs> <laughs> and then it like it does like four or five times, and it like ends with Dennis that dude's Hays- deep raspy. Vo- De- yeah, that Dennis guy. Haysburg. Yeah, and then it's just oh yeah, yeah. Wow, that's a good fucking commercial. Like yeah, I was like, where's the? That's not the Allstate guy, and it's like. <clears throat> With Ulster, you know the <laughs> only person I've ever heard that has a deeper voice than that dude is uh you ever hear Corpse Husband? That no. dude, fuck, Who's he's that? uh he's an artist who makes like songs. Hey, you're fine. Dina does it all the time. Yeah, I know he does. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sing metal? Nah, he uh, he makes like music. He has like five songs or some shit out. He just started this year. Are you a metal fan? I'll listen to anything. Yeah, even country? No. Ye- sometimes. No. Yeah. Ye- no. <laughs> Yeehaw. You Dude. heed your last haul. <laughs> it's so great. You want to hear something crazy? Why? What? I used to work at this Bananas. place that we had to dress up like cowboys, and it was Fuck. a... Little kids amusement park. Whoa! So no assless chaps. Jesus. Yeah. No. Just <laughs> but you, the owners were very strict on it. You had to talk in an accent sometimes. Oh, are you serious? If the owner was by you, <clears throat> howdy y'all, how are y'all doing today? Oh, you literally had to talk like that all day long, and you'd be working like eight hour shifts or twelve hours. Can shifts. I be a Louisiana Southern boy? Yeah. Oh, like they, Tom Kench from League of Legends. I promise you, they would love it. My uh, I do declare. Jesus. But yeah, I had a. Drug. I would not succumb not to culinary good. degradation. <laughs> but besides just the accent, you had to wear cowboy boots. Yeah. You had to wear a yeah, cowboy did, did hat. Did you have to get your own? Yes. Oh, that's but, fucked. It but it? you get it as a tax write off. Oh, okay. okay. But I never but me because I I ended up really liking cowboy boots and everything. So now I just own a bunch of cowboy boots. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, they're comfy. They started a. Uh, but what's an your thoughts on country music though? Uh, I mean the new. But you'll wear it. New stuff, I think, is sucks. Yeah, I like the stuff. I like the nineties like country. Old stuff, Dude, they just yeah. pander. It's always just pandering. You ever you know, hear Bo Burnham's song? What? Oh, uh, there there was one day I was singing. I'm like, what is that one country song? And I tried telling my brother. I'm like, do you know that one song <laughs> where one he's song. talking about the cornfield and stuff? And he goes, isn't that Bo Burnham's joke about? It? I'm like. Yeah. That's what it was. That's what it was. <laughs> it's so fucking funny, dude. It's uh, um, no, but I mostly listen to like rap, alternative, and yeah. uh, some metal stuff. I listen to a little bit of everything too. Bear Tooth yeah. is definitely my favorite. Which I've one? Like Bear Tooth how- as metal band. Never heard of him. I know Bear Tooth. Do you know? Well, the singer came from Attack Attack. Do you know Attack Attack? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's he yep. showing me them. They're, did you see that they're coming back? No, I well, I I I saw a small Reddit forum on it. They're they're. Doing something, I um I guess if I had to pick all time favorite b- metal band, after the burial, hands yeah. down. Yeah. Um, I'm a sucker for eight string guitars though, mm-hmm. just because that heaviness to it. But yeah, I same thing here. Like metal, um, you know I do listen to some rap. I guess it's a very specific artist. Um, I love to, I love Tyler you know the Creator. You listen oh, to yeah. Tyler's, Tyler's great. Yes, I love Ty and, and even like some other stuff like you know. Like there, it's it's a weird mix. I don't know why. It's no, like, you listen to a lot of rap actually. I love tribe rap. tribe called yeah. Quest. Rap is like probably the most I'll listen no to. Nerubian but... Doom. Oh, you but, fucking listen to Kendrick so, Lamar. So, I'm sorry, it's like a, you got a bunch of people. MF Doom. Yeah, is another one. He's over there like I don't listen oh yeah to rap. yeah yeah right. Oh uh, like a couple. Okay, he fucking has like ten uh, <laughs> just <laughs> off the list. Yeah. <laughs> Lately, I've been getting a lot of like house music. Like yeah, just, oh dude, dude same house actually. Music, bro. Like, you know what? Uh, are, are you like it's crazy? Like like, bitch like animals oh. like okay. animals that's, by Martin Garrix, right? That's <laughs> the basic, that is basic bitch right no, no, no. <laughs> The basic bitch stuff you're talking animals. about. That's like EDM. That's EDM, bro. Like house music, totally different. Like just. 
Yo. Like uh, Chicago subgenre. I'm trying like, uh. Swedish House Mafia. They're, they're like OG, like yeah, that, that's yeah. that's house I'd start music. Right? Listening Daft to Punk. Some other shit. Daft Punk is house music. I love house Daft Punk. techno. Love. House techno. Their funk. music videos are yeah. so creative, and I love. Oh, really their are. shows are. Absolutely but like that's still like insane. Not even new stuff. Probably yeah. better on Daft drugs. Punk, dude. dude, if they ever play again in America, I'm going. Get I have Lucky to. was, I think, their best album. I was like, what the Get fuck, out. dude? I loved it. That's not their fucking mess. I, I loved it. You're mm. basic, man. I am. I am. I am. That's basic. You guys ever heard of? You guys ever heard of Bangarang? Yeah. Bangarang. <laughs> no, Loki Bass. though. Old, that music video old, was cool, for though. dubstep. Old school Skrillex. It's fire. I yeah. just, I old never school really Skrillex. got it. Besides you know, a scary monster. Yeah, that that that's, that's the only one I so, know. Like, you know. That's his best. I, shit, I was playing so. Skrillex one time. My mom. Just oh yeah, you were playing with him. Yeah. Right. You no, I was playing on, in my room. You, you go up on stage and you're. Oh hell no! <laughs> That's what I thought he said. I was no, like, no, so, so I, I was playing Skrillex in my room. My mom comes by, you know, just given how old fashioned she is, and she's like, "Man, this just sounds like like a bunch of printers going off at once." <laughs> Jesus. But then again, you know, when she, she she was hearing me just, like listen to metal and any kind of screaming or anything like that, she's like, "Piotr, you want to talk about it?" <laughs> Did she okay. thought you were like emo? Yeah, like, yeah, she was in like, a suicidal phase. Like, well, right. okay, but but I, I had that phase. You, you, yeah, Everybody yeah. had that he phase. Had we all grew up hair. in the same time. <laughs> I saw Actually, Dead Mouse the other week. Who? What? Dead Mouse. Did you really? Yeah. Where? I went to the car drive-in show like a week. Oh, ago. I heard about that. Actually. Yo, he's Did we fucking... play in Illinois. Yeah, it was my sister's wedding that same day. I ditched her wedding to go to Dead Mouse. Yo, he's actually really cool. <laughs> what? Sorry, sis. I came back. I, I gave her some drugs, and she was good. <laughs> Allegedly. Allegedly. <laughs> that did not wedding. happen. It, honestly, it's her wedding. She doesn't need No, no, no. That part, that's fine. That's yeah, the, the, the drugs, allegedly. That didn't. Yeah. That. Hey, legal drugs are legal, okay? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. It was prescribed to her. Legal there drugs. It was legal drugs. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Medical card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, you don't even need a medical card. You just go to yeah. fucking. Yeah, that's true. Dispenser. Hey, dispenser now and just yeah. pay overpriced money. Yeah. What's the. Go on. Talking about music, did you know that uh, the guitarist for Cheap Trick lived in Rockford? No. Hmm. No. I won't. Yo. There's, surprisingly, there's actually a lot of Illinois. stuff from Chicago Land Suburbs. There are a lot, um, actually. Lot Rage Against the Machine. Yeah. Yep. Uh, Tom Morello's from Libertyville. Speaking yeah. of Rage. Uh, uh, which we got tickets and we can't uh, fucking see them. Yeah. So we had tickets to see them. I know, dude. All the time. At <laughs> that least was once. a big one. <laughs> that was. Uh, yeah, we got tickets to see them over the summer, this last summer, but obviously. I miss concerts. Over, yeah. I miss so concerts. And then, like, drive in shows didn't start to, like, the end of summer. I think that's yeah. a great idea, which though. They really should have been doing. They it was, no, it was great. You get your own little area, you take your car full of, like, yeah. up to six people. You get your own like whole ass like square party. Do well, whatever they, the fuck they you want. They had to do it. Or you don't they were have to. Yeah, exactly. Die. Yeah. No, that even like you don't have to deal with other fucking people rubbing on you. The thing is, I think about that too. Is like the drive-in stuff, Mo- like drive-in movie theaters sneak in that are shit. left yeah. are booming now. Oh, oh absolutely. They are. The absolutely. governor yeah. of like our area is absolutely. just trying to like fist them. Be like, you can't be doing that COVID shit. But they're like, yeah. I'm following all the regulations. Everybody that yeah. It's a, it was it, a no, dead genius. It was a dead business. And now it's a booming COVID. business. Yeah. Yep. And but I think the only it, one I know in our area. There's one like far, ain't it? Like well, 30 or 45 minutes. You. Yeah, that's true. For yeah. me, it's not. It's that's close. the only one that I know of right yeah. now. I don't want to get political, but they said like the economy is dying, but I feel like it like kind of. It's in a weird. It's it like kind of so, it went down a little, but then it like some stuff went down, down, other yeah, stuff went up. Exactly. Yeah. So, so the thing it I, didn't go super down. It kind of just went a little bit. The down. thing I can tell you is the biggest thing that we're worried about, from my perspective, yeah. is film. Yeah, that hundred percent. Since yeah. Disney I have, Disney I, made oh. actually a good amount of money off of Mulan, no matter how bad that even movie though was, it was just on like even Disney though it Plus, was yeah. everyone's ratings are terrible for yeah, them. Yeah, all live action. It made garbage. so much money, so now they're like, do we continue going to produce movies yeah. in the movie oh, theaters just Plus, or just yeah. straight to? <sighs> Because they can take Amazon, no, Netflix, whatever. That and too, they can take a huge break right now, and make shit pretty lazily. Mm-hmm. Like, they, I, yeah. so I can tell you right now, though, the reason if you guys are watching the news uh-huh. for media at all, yeah. um, they've been really trying to like fist down, putting a lot of stuff produced right now uh-huh. because they think we're gonna have another lockdown. Yep. Yeah. So we have all that stuff edit because that's one or two people editing. Yeah. So that way you'll have it in in the. What well, I really wanted media. to see that I didn't get to see in theaters this year was Tenant. Uh, it'll be on, it looked it'll good. Be on, yeah, yeah. Amazon. It, I, Amazon has a lot of deals only, right now. 
I, I I didn't see it. I saw the trailers and I was like, whatever. I, didn't I love the those suspensional, yeah. those suspenseful thrillers. So I, think, I love that shit. Do you think that with the current film industry, let's say, because you know people are predicting that this sort of lifestyle that we're in right now is, is going to be permanent for, oh, a while. I've seen, for a while. I've seen studies that they said that we will not go back to normal for another three years. Yeah, so Although, which is crazy. They just came out with that vaccine crazy. that's supposedly ninety percent effective. So who yeah, knows? I'll, so do you think that? A right, it's gonna move to movies that are being produced now, right? Being more like, hey, this movie, this movie's coming out, right? Watch it on this title, yeah. on this on this platform, trying yeah. to give everyone's competing for kind of like the edge. They, they are like Hulu's oh, doing yeah, it, I Netflix so. is doing it, Disney Plus, hundred percent. The, all, the question is, doing it. does it stay that way afterwards? And I think that, I think probably, that was gonna be their goal, regardless. Now they just have to. We had this that. whole huge war of digitalness. So yeah. Like, of we got Amazon, you got Hulu, sure. Netflix, HBO Go. They're Dude, all like, yeah. oh, Netflix did Can't really good, the shit. and now they're trying to like get it going. Yep. And now they're now, now they, they saw, have to. Now they saw Disney make Mulan. Yeah. I just subscribed to Shutter because I wanted to watch a movie, and yeah. then um, the Shutter DC- is big. It, yeah, it really. As, as much as people don't know about yeah. it yet. Yeah. Shutter is growing. If you're a and then horror DC, fan, and then the, it is growing. Yeah. And then the DC, like the DC, like because I wanted to watch some of the Harley Quinn episodes. Okay. Yep. And I like, I want to see the really Brendan Fraser. See, is that the rated R one? Yeah, it's really fucking. What's fun. the one with Brendan Fraser? What's that called? He's Tin Man or an art. Oh, you guy or something. No, no, no. He's talking about the live action one. Um, yeah. No, 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 no. The Harley Quinn animated series. It's rated R. You know, on DC. Mesh is talking about something different. No, okay. Yeah. Awkward. Go on. Awkward. No, no, no. Like, it's the live it's on action DC, one. Like, where, what yeah. is it? With, it's a DC uh, TV show and it has Swamp Thing. Or not oh, Swamp, Swamp. Thing. Oh. Not, not no, Swamp no, no. Thing. Yeah, is it the Protectors? Something like that. Uh, yeah. But it's a, it's a different Fantastic Four, but DC, That's they had DC's one too. DC's version of Fantastic Four, pretty much. I'm yeah. upset that Swamp Thing got canceled. Yeah, Swamp yeah. Thing. Yeah. So apparently I'm, it was really good too. I'm a huge DC person, yeah. unfortunately. Like, everyone talks shit so, about them. <laughs> they just but don't well, know their Swamp Thing was Their animation is great. People said it was amazing. They just did one season and then that's the, it. Their animation is beautiful. And yeah. actually, their TV sh- series have been okay. pretty garbage. Right. Oh, no, I, I they're think animated, right. they're the, animated is, is what's superior. I'll yeah. tell you right Animated now, sure. Marvel has it for the they're live action. Oh, 100%. DC, yeah. they, they're animated. in charge of that. See, yeah. They yeah. got that in the books. I don't understand why DC doesn't capitalize on the rated R superhero films. A lot of those are really they Joker's could've. really good. I thought... Uh, Joker was great. So, Joker was really good. But so here's the they're thing, all though. like non-canon. They're all different. They don't know how to canonize like all their shit, like make it in one universe. Oh, the problem they keep that- making like... If you if you canonize it, you kind of like fuck the the comics. Everything else too. Yeah. Not even that. Like they could just say it's another timeline because that's what they can look. Oh, that's do. what Marvel Joker, does. Joker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the thing but, I was about to say, is Joker is. F- go ask someone that doesn't know superheroes, doesn't know any kind uh-huh. of sure. Th- they're like, what do you think of the Joker? They're like, oh, I thought it was like a psycho killer movie. They don't yeah, know that it was a Joker true. origin Another movie. Another thing, th- I actually know a little bit that's insight true. about this. They don't know. The guy who wanted to make the movie wanted to make it about mental illnesses and things like oh, that. Oh, you can tell but 100%. He, c- he could not get the money for it. Absolutely. He couldn't get the yeah. money for it. He couldn't get funding. He's like, oh, I'm going to make a Joker film. <laughs> and they're like, okay, here's all this money. Yeah. And then it made it work. He still got his point across. He still made something everyone loved, and he made it about the Joker, which mm-hmm. was fucking great for him. It's, 100%. Yeah. It, it, it happens with Marvel movies, too, like... You know that film, um, Logan? Which, by the way, I thought it was actually really, really, really cool. good. Yeah. That, was before, was that was before Disney owned it. Yeah. Before Disney owned it? Okay. Yeah. Um, it was still really fucking good. Lo- yeah, so Logan, right, I thought was absolutely fantastic. It was cool to see an old, battered Wolverine, oh, yeah. you know, just like going through life. Old man yeah. Logan. Just It's much more realistic feeling. Now, I'm sure, have any of you read, like, the old man Logan comics? Yep. Like... It, it, it's I only pretty, read Green Lantern. I wish so, they did so, Green so Lantern. It's pretty he, to the comic. That's, well, that's the best. He, he literally straight up murders the all the X-Men. Yeah. Yeah. You know oh, that, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he like, would not show that in a regular PG-13 film, right? I just... They could capitalize on like, that. Like, Marvel films are great. Don't get me wrong, right? But there, there are times where I definitely do wish it was rated R to show some kind of Other like things. Yeah. there's a lot of fucked up shit everything like, it's also that concept it's like when you watch Pirates of the Caribbean and you see you guys that are doing a sword battle and a guy gets stabbed but there's yeah. no blood no yeah. blood <laughs> 100% even in anime because I read a lot of manga now. I never used to read manga until I started watching like anime recently Yeah, which I was like yo I want to know what happens next so I read the manga 
And then I I'm do just, that all the time. And then I'm just like, they're never going to show this. And then the next I season do comes out, they the never Avatar. show it. Yeah. I've been so addicted have you, to Avatar. Have you... Wait, Legend of Korra or Avatar? I've lost all. Oh, which one do I like better? Yeah, yeah. I have Avatar. Okay, good. good. I mean, <laughs> I was just like, me and my, my brother just started watching Korra. Yeah. And it's, it's the first okay. season good. He'll, first season's great. He'll Bloodbenders? Tell, he'll text me the whole time. Steve yeah. He goes, why the fuck is Korra such a bitch? Aang was three years or four years <laughs> younger, and she's just getting smacked around the whole time. Well, I guess that's yeah. the thing, right? It's yeah. like, she can't live up to the expectation. She's yeah. never going to. Right. I do like how and they Aang introduced... And already had airbending. He already had the hardest thing to master Season already. 3 is the best of you. Yeah. yeah. So th- th- that's actually another example to my point then. Um, you know Legend of Korra, the first season when they had bloodbenders? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, I no, really, no blood, right? I loved Amon. I Steve loved Blum. I would love to see concept. what that would be. Right. Like, I don't know. In Avatar. Fucking... Yeah, he wasn't yeah. really deleting powers. He was just using bloodbending, which is great because uh, There's no Katara blood. did it. But, I don't think oh, there would right. be a lot of blood to show is because... Because it's all moving inside, it's inside you. inside you. I, I know. They're I know. Not I'm just... They're a puppet. It, it's just... It's just... Yeah. I guess I guess I'm just trying to make and a point across. You, you gotta get... It's also on Nickelodeon. They can't go over... Wait, do, do they have yeah, uh, streaming they service by themselves? No, but they were Nickelodeon only for the yeah, rumors. Rumors that they might be teaming up with Netflix. Dude, it's Ooh. cable with extra steps. I'm, yeah, I'm telling yeah, yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. you know, Once it's on Netflix, there's gonna be blood. Yo, know, Netflix actually released a uh, Chappelle show on there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Which, oh, it's great. Oh, yeah. the the it's actual great. Chappelle the actual show. OG yeah, yeah. Chappelle it's, show. It's, it's fucking One great. episode's not on there. I saw though. Really? Um, I didn't know that. One of the skits, I can't remember who it was with. They said that they can't show it for some reason. Oh, that's I'll shitty. Look, I'll look it up. Probably uh some sort of like copyright maybe. Yeah. No, or it's some, it's, like, it's some, like, no, arrogant it's, shit. It's, like, no, some... it's with somebody. They cannot oh. show it. with Oh, them. really? That's interesting. Yeah. Is it? I think it's that one dude. No, I think it's Jeremy something. Is it, he's an actor? Oh, I'll, I'll look it up. Right Is now. he an actor? Yeah. Jeremy Renner. Hold on. Renner. Jeremy. You mean Hawkeye? Skoblonsky. No, <laughs> no, Jeremy Smith. No. no, it's not. I don't think it's Why Jeremy do Renner. Names? Oof. <laughs> yeah, but uh. Yeah. I gotta pee. We. Oh. It's, it, we're we're gonna wrap it up actually. I think oh. it's it's uh it's been an hour and a half. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. It went went by yeah. fast. Yeah, dude. Right? Normally we only do like an hour. Cause we, we talk. Ron know? Jeremy. Ron. Ron oh. Jeremy. The Ron Jeremy. Wait. Episode. Wait. 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 HBO, HBO has rights on it. Yeah. Oh, well, plus I he, believe it. I believe it. He got fucking locked up too. Yeah. He's yeah. Not, he's not. They for, can't show it for raping. We're really, in an hour people. and a half. Yeah, dude. Hour and a half. Bro, uh, this is gonna be forever to have it. Dude, that's okay. We'll make fire do it. No, dude, make, it a, make it a Christmas special. Dude. How are you a porn <laughs> star and you get accused of that? He yeah, has pretty fucked. It's uh, it's called you get fat. I, I'm just saying. It's called you want right? that check. Yeah. Well, dude, so, it makes me angry that this guy is as ugly as he is, right? Just getting all the. See, here's the, the thing though. He so, wasn't ugly back in the day when yeah, he was like a correct. porn star. He started thing. doing like a lot of fucking like plastic. You get you get yeah. money. Yeah. You get happy. You get, you get happy fat. fat. Yeah. yeah. Money so is fat. Can you draw me a, a graph for that on your iPad? Uh, <laughs> draw me a tattoo of that. <laughs> no, I'll do a graph. Real yeah, quick. actually, I'm gonna ask you to tattoo that on me. So, Jesus. for you guys, while he's doing that, <laughs> having two special guests right now, how how do you think the episode went? Because as an editor too, I'm curious to hear you guys' opinions right now. Uh, uh, I think and, this and is one the, of our better ones. Guys, for the audience to know great. too. Yeah, yeah, I think this is one of our better episodes. It, it's really cool to you kind of ask you guys questions about that kind of thing and just. Knowing about your <laughs> money, I, I love the dips. Because <laughs> you, you get you go Say to the, that. you go to the, I will put that like, on there right now. You go to the gym for a little bit. Like I got, I'm gonna get a personal trainer. You go back <laughs> down. You, you go back. You go back down a no, little bit, and then it's like, oh, I love sushi too much. We I love cream. We're going to the gym again, like literally before the fucking right, podcast. Right, right, just, just, just explain to me one more time, like. Oh, How, Jesus. What is that correlation? <laughs> you get um, money, you like to eat good food. Sure. Yep, and then you get fat. Get Boom. money, get bitches. <laughs> <laughs> get money, get like ramen, get like oh, fucking, oh so much good fuck. food. Bro. Oh, man, dude. So, uh, what were you guys saying? Because I'm curious, actually. Yeah, for, uh, and for, for like background for the audience to know, too, is how they. Yeah, I mean, I think this is easily top three. Like, top three episodes, easily. Yeah. Uh, I, I think it even could take oh, one. Yeah, bro. Yeah. It, I mean, all I'm learning is we need to kick Dino and Ferret off more often. That's crazy. Yeah. I don't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> That's not my vote, boys. <laughs> it's um, So yeah. it, it is really cool to just learn more about it. Um, both of you guys do a craft, which honestly, I have I have nothing really that kind of experience. I'm not really good at anything like that. Yeah, you just right? swindle people. 
Yeah, you're yeah. going to school. You're going to school for something. Yeah, I you'll know. Shine. You'll but, shine. But, but, but pro like, I'm not one of those nerds that looks at program. Like, I think he's oh, talking yeah. about. I think he's talking about art in general. Like <laughs> art is like a whole different. I'm, I'm not. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. not like. Oh man, this programming looks so neat. Oh. I mean, oh, I think yeah. you are. Oh yeah, <laughs> look at these semicolons at the end. You, you Proper s- indentation. Look, man, you send me pictures and uh, of your code sometimes, and I. I don't oh yeah, know. I'm look. Look at this. Look at his yeah. HTML porn right here. <laughs> <laughs> no, I definitely get it. Like I was. Wa- I recently I've been watching a lot of sushi documentaries, and this one guy said. He wants to either like grow up to be a sushi chef or he wants to be a baseball star. He started off as a baseball star, got injured his shoulder. Yeah. It was Chef Morimoto, like the fucking <laughs> Iron Chef dude. Yeah, yeah. He wanted to be a fucking baseball player or some shit. Dude, that shit's rough. And he got and he got injured. So he it's started really becoming just like a chef. And sushi chefs are crazy. Is and there's four? this one guy who said uh, no, I think that's what he said. He said, If you wanna be two things, you can't you're gonna half ass oh, both gosh. things. You gotta have like one goal. Surprise it's me. And coming to like this, I always either wanted to be a voice actor or a tattoo artist. Like, you want to be a voice either, actor? Either or, yeah. Like, I I love manipulating. Well, I've been like keep, copying keep, voices like forever. Keep communication. I can. But the I thing got is, ends. you can I do both. You can I do both. can, but I want to focus on it's one. Fucked, first. I'm sorry. I want to like get I to one uh, point and to the, the other. It's. It's that prospect of yeah. like you, you especially see you gotta sushi you gotta chef. whole ass one thing before you half ass two things. You, you yep. see these sushi chefs, right? With especially it's like an art. Right? sushi well, chefs. Dude, they like, are like I, I was watching That's Anthony Bourdain, art. and this guy was an underground um, bare knuckle like karate fighter, and then he switched to sushi. Dude, but he but he has but he has art. one goal in mind. He just always wants to be the best sushi chef, and that is oh, the yeah. kind of craft and dedication that I just Absolutely. simply don't have. That's that's why it's kind of cool. I would love to see something like that. Um, believe believe yeah. it or not, but before I um, changed my major, I actually wanted to. I took a few culinary classes and such because I did want to be. a You chef. made some good food. I remember just coming over sometimes. Be still, like, I'm uh, cooking. Still take second to me though. Don't, that's true. Don't I still that. take it to second, right? <laughs> uh, and Chris has never cooked me anything though. It's uh, I can uh, fix that. After this, <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you um, that job. I do give people credit for it. It is tough. Even Honestly, even when you make chef, the big leagues, it's being, tough. Being a chef for sure is being. Is, it's the is most for work sure for art. the least amount of pay. I feel like it's really tasty art. Yeah, it is. It is. So, I guess my point is right. It's cool to talk about it and see your guys' craft at work because you guys take so much pride into it. And I, like I, said, I absolutely yeah. do appreciate that, especially your your editing and your yeah, amazing artwork and stuff. It's something you can look back on and be like, "Oh, it's there. Like, it's there. Yeah, yeah. I did. yeah. <laughs> yeah like you did that, right?" I'm never like, man, look at my code, right? Because unfortunately, all of that is um, it's back end. Oh, this no one this sees internet that. security right here. No, yeah. no, one, no one sees. <laughs> I'm not like, oh yeah, look at that server I set up. <laughs> oh, this website. I made the I made the, the scroll work. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I don't know how it works. I don't know how it works. Seriously, that, that is how it is. It's just you know, when you're when you're a programmer, right? Which you work in the back end most of the time, where you know the front stuff you. Is what everyone sees. No one sees the stuff that goes behind, like the calculations. There's so right? much shit. You're you're the young sung hero. That's what's cool about it. Yeah, yeah. What's your art, Chris? What do you do? I play video games and I set up servers. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I don't have art. No, I suck at art. A, this is an awesome episode. Very informative. I choose yeah. that, bro. Yeah. Cheers to that, guys. Cheers Good episode. To that. Oh, oh, I can't. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Let's just, let's just go. Yeah. We, we can fix that. I, I only got a little bit, so that's just, enough. Uh, just just fill it up. It's uh, I, I think it's almost out actually. Tip I think. It, tip it, I, I I think we actually almost finished this thing. Let's finish it. Fuck. I feel like I finished. I got work right. at eight thirty. That's fine. Oh, I got work at seven tomorrow. That's all I'm trying to learn. I got work out at eight. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, when I used to work out in the mornings, it'd be like five thirty, six a.m. And it was Jeez. it was the so, greatest. You leave, you don't got to do shit after work. Yeah, I'm gonna say as your the editor side, mm-hmm. I'm gonna be hitting up, putting his Instagram to check you guys, make sure yes. you guys check him out. Yes. Sometimes upcoming me up artists and everything. Yes, and obviously you know me as the editor. Most I got definitely. nothing on my Instagram, just basically per- definitely personal put that up stuff. On there. Um, but yeah. That's all I, I really wanted to say right now. Thank you guys for coming to this AA meeting. I really, we really appreciate it. Yeah, I'm glad I gave up on this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Have a good day. Uh, Cheers to that. Cheers to that, guys. Do you have an outro song? Is it goes like... Actually, we do. We do. We definitely do. Yeah. That is how exactly And this is all in. Make sure you guys uh, subscribe to our Patreon.
Yeah, you know. I mean, we kind of already hit the Patreon, but fuck it. I mean, you know what? Fuck it. We'll start an OnlyFans, too. Yeah, that's right. Try to OnlyFans. Inebriated anal wise. Thanks for taking time.